So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go, um, we're gonna go to um, this one right here, because that will lead us back to Margaret Maida's base. And um, that will be the one that, that kind of seemed like the closest entrance to like where I needed to go to like get deeper into that area. I, I just, I really hope that we can find it again without having like too much um, of an issue. Because it was like, that place was like the crystal area with the purple crystals. It was like such a maze. It just, it, it like, it was so hard to tell which way you were going, if you were even going deeper. But the last part that we were at, it, it did kind of seem like that, so... I'm hoping, I'm hoping. Welcome back, Wade. Thanks, Gwen. I appreciate you being listening on my phone and playing this. Yeah, no, I never want to do, like, spoilers or anything like, like that for you, Bean. I just love my Gwen so much, but, uh, I just, I just never want to, uh, spoil your experience or... Or the experience of anybody's. But it sounds like you're making some really good progress already. Found the found the diamonds and all that jazz. Alright. Another thing that I still have a question on is uh is where that um Omega Lab is. The Omega Lab is apparently in the lily pad biome. I just kind of wish that it gave us like a Unless I've missed it in, um, unless I've missed it in, whatchamacallit, um, the, the, um, DNA stuff doomahickey, um, it doesn't really seem like it, there's anywhere that tells you, like, how far down it is, because I feel like knowing its depth would, would be really helpful. He thinks. He thinks. All right. So, um, was this? Did I go down the right way? I just kind of like went straight down. Usually, I don't find the entrance to this that easy. Okay. Yeah, I think this is it. I believe so. All right. So let's uh, let's see if we can find good old Marguerite Maida's base again, and that will lead us into the uh, the scary place of doom and despair. I don't know if it was here or the one behind us. What is this here? What are you? Uh, can I not scan you? Prawn suit grappling arm fragments. We'll see. Well, it'll be definitely interesting to see if I end up making a, a prawn suit in this playthrough. Like, I was thinking that maybe surely I needed to to get the Kyanite, but we've already found places where you can just grab it, which is really interesting to me. I'm going back out, aren't I? Yeah, this is this is not the way. Yeah, this is going back outward. So we need to go back through here. Excuse me, pardon me, coming through. Definitely need to repair before we get down into that crystal area too. Cause I don't want to uh, have to have to deal with that so when we're in a, a enemy heavy territory. I must have taken like a wrong turn. Um I'm a little disoriented here, just like the least. Is it through here? Yes, okay, here we go. This is correct. Alright, back on track, my friends. I got the moon pool now too. Nice, nice. I feel like it took me a really long... This isn't it. Um, I feel like it took me like a really long time to find the moon pool. But at the same time, like, at the beginning of the game, like, I, like, heavily, like, pretty much, like, solely focused on, like, the land stuff. And a lot of, like, other people that I've spoken to... Um... Have you been in here before? A lot of other people that I've spoken to, they've focused more on the, uh... Yikes. Um, the aquatic stuff. Understandably so, because, you know, it's Subnautica. Or just, like... I think I've been in here before? I think. This will you just back out? 
It's just like a little cave there, I guess. I suppose. Um, it's kind of weird. I'm just so disoriented right now. I don't know where I am. Was this going back down to the anemone place? Where is the signal for Margaret? It's more over there. So this is probably... No. Yeah, to get to Margaret, you have to like go through like all these tunnels. Okay. All right. So we're going to go back this way. Let's retry that again, my friends. I think we need to like go like completely out and then like back down like into like another area. It's just really interesting that they've like f fit like all of these biomes like kind of like in the same area. Um but like somehow the like anemone one and the one with like the the crystal the blue, the purple crystal is like completely like separated. So yeah, I really do wonder why they put like all of the deep biomes underneath um the the lily pad area. I kind of do wish that they were I kind of do wish that they were more like spread out. Like you had one of them underneath um I don't know, some other biome and then one of them like underneath here it just kind of seems like too like centralized but that's just me that's just my two cents um i feel like i'm really going out of the way now yeah let's just let's just go up let's just go up excuse me big rock boy pardon me coming through sir have i been in this one I don't think there is anything in here. Um, yeah. It is interesting that you can like swim. This is like the second one that we've come across that you can kind of like swim in, but I, there's table coral in here, but I kind of wish that there was like some more resources in here. But yeah, I'm not really seeing any. Where's my sea truck? Right here. Okie dokies. Cool beans. Okay, so let's um go. Where are we going? Where are we going, friends? We're going um over here. By the time I actually like find this thing again, we might have to like go back and get some more uh some more hydration and stuff because I just drank my last water. Maybe this is a bad idea. Always struggle to find the entrance. Don't think it's here. Don't think. I think it's not. Let um, me go a little more this way, maybe? Um, that kind of looks like a light there. That might be it. Yeah, this is looking promising. All right, I think we're on the right track. Oh, maybe not. Maybe not. Oh, it just led back out here. Crap. I was thinking we were on to it again. Why do I always struggle to, uh, to, to find it? I will say the the devs of Subnautica, they just really do a fantastic job of hiding things, like, in plain sight. Taking advantage of all the, the nooks and crevices. Mm, the biomes are a lot more interconnected than in a and in Subnautica one. Like, I've definitely noticed that, like, with that that um, that purple crystal um, cave thing that we're going into, it seems like there's a lot of entrances um, from different biomes. But maybe, like, I I question, like, does it feel more connected? because the map's a lot smaller? Or is this a ultra high capacity tank? It is, it is, I need this. Can I make it now? What do I need? What do I need for it? Tell me all the things. I'm like, I'm low key tempted to go back and make this if I can before we go anywhere. That is so simple. Oh my gosh. Um. <sighs> 
I was not expecting to find this here. Okay. Um. Guys, especially with us going deeper. I think I might go make this real quick. Would you guys mind? Would you care too much if I went and did that? I feel like it would be really helpful. And that way we can get some more water too. Almost at 10 hours now. Ooh, you put a lot of time into it already, Gwen. GG, GG. Right, yeah, Rochelle, that would, yeah, same thought, same thought. So that way we can kind of kill two birds with one stone and then I'll try to find the entrance again. Oh, I'm so glad that I found that. I was really wondering where it was. Because I had had it, like, the first part of the blueprint, like, sitting in my inventory for a hot minute. Like, one thing that I'll say that I'm not doing a very good job of in this, uh, in the, you know, my first playthrough of, uh, Below Zero. Like, with Subnautica, it, like, if you find a, a fragment for something in one area, like, more times than not, you're going to find any other fragment for you, that you need for that blueprint in like the same area um and i just i really haven't been doing a good job of paying attention to where i'm getting fragments from and like continuing to search those areas so if y'all see me do that again just slap me on the wrist a little bit Seems a bit more streamlined, which isn't bad. I uh, do enjoy how open the first one was. Like, I'll say that um, with the the first one, like, I don't feel like I ever had a sensation of feeling lost um, because it did a, such a good job of giving you, like, the radio signals when you needed them and it leading you to something. And, like, you know, if it gave you a radio signal, like more times than not, it was like always because it's like, okay, this is in an area where like you need something from or you can go deeper in the game. And I feel like I've had more instances in Below Zero where I've like kind of come to a standstill where I've been like, all right, I've already explored like all of the beacons that I have, like now what? So I feel like maybe this one pushes you a little more to do some of your own exploration. Um. Which, you know, if for someone that's like feels like they have done all the exploration, which is not me, I'm not saying that's me because I know there's still a lot that I need to explore, but maybe for someone that feels like they have explored everything, if they're feeling like stuck, I feel like some of those like beacons and signals could be really helpful. Um, but like at the same time, it, you know, it might not be as needed as the first game since obviously the map isn't quite as big. So yeah, I kind of have mixed feelings about it. Four lithium is what we need. I'll stop blabbing over here. And I forgot that we have our like our plants over here too. So I might not even need to, uh, to go and grab some bladder fish. We'll see what we can get from those. All right, one, two, three, four. And then we'll go over here and I'll take off this and then we'll go over here and I think it's this one. Yeah. So I'll be interested to see how much we can actually breathe now. All right, automatically put it on. So I think we went one from 135 to 180. Nice. I'll take it. I will take it. Cool beans. Unpin that. And let's go over here. So uh, Chinese potato. Preston's plants, Frost of Oz plant, Marble Melon. Probably need to, because I want to do like some more, um, can I like not crouch really? I wanted to like try to like cut this so I could like make some more seeds of it, but it's really not having it right now. <laughs> to be fair, I put it in like the not so best place. Is there like a crouch button in this game? Guys, I, like, I can't. Let me, let me do this. Because I, I really need to replant that because that was my only marble melon that I had. I mean, we could go back to the, the greenhouse. All right, if I drop you, then we, okay. 
that works. <laughs> that's that's one way to do it. Not like my initial way of trying to do that, but hey, it got the job done. All right, switch those over there. Um, can I eat the raw Preston plant? I know we can like turn it into salad if I had uh, like the the pepper, but I don't. So yeah. We might have to go back to um, the 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 Arctic Island place and grab some more of those, which I feel like we're gonna have to do anyway because when we were the last time that we were there, we had that unfortunate encounter with the ice worm. And but I didn't really find anything in that area, and it's like obviously it's like guarding something. So I feel like we're going to have to go back and, and do some more exploration there. Let me see about... I don't know if I can even cut this because of how like awkward a spot it's in. Well, that's not good. Um... Well, that's not what I meant to cut there, but okay. We'll go ahead and replant you two. Cool beans. Um, let's eat that. So yeah, this like gives us a tiny bit of H2O, but really not that much. Um, where's my Bulbo trees? I really miss my Bulbo trees so much, so much. All right, so I'm gonna eat those. We'll, I was about to say we'll replant the, oh, I accidentally put them in there. I didn't mean to do that. All right, we'll just eat that then. That works. Um, I definitely would like to get some some um, ladder fish. Can I not cut the Preston plant at all? Maybe... Oh. Good in salad. So you can't eat it raw. I guess I had one in here, so I could have just tried it that way. Oh, but the delight. Maybe we can do that. Does it regrow the delight, or...? Can I grab the other ones? Oh, they're in such like an awkward spot. It gives you five H2O. I'd really like to replant a, another one. Come on, come on. Such an awkward spot. Frost vase, yeah, that's not what I want. I don't think, oh, oh, I saw it for a second. I saw it for a second. Where was it? Where was it? Give me, give me the sweet spot. Oh, 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 oh. There we go. <laughs> All right, we'll um, switch that over there. So at least we're growing some more of them now, which will hopefully be like a little easier to grab. I really should not have grown them in this spot. We might have to move over everything, but yeah. I need to drink my tea, guys. Let me put some, uh, some stevia in there. Just so much to see though. It's easy to see how you get sidetracked like 100%. Like I, I'm sorry if like constantly throughout this playthrough or like, you know, any game for that matter. I'm like always the type of person that's like, ooh, shiny. Let me go over here when I was supposed to be going over there instead. But just, you know, part of me, I feel like that's kind of like the name of the game with a, uh, with like open world exploration type stuff. Um, cause you know, if it was supposed to be like completely linear and you were supposed to do something in a certain way, like obviously, you know, it just, it wouldn't be really like open world type stuff where you'd have more direction and that kind of thing. So I like that. I like that. Uh, Phantom and I, we were kind of talking about that the other day when, uh, both of us were, were playing Pine. I say the other day, but it was, it was probably like two weeks ago. I still never finished Pine cause, uh, then this game came out. Plus I was running into like a lot of like issues with Pine too, but for the for uh, the majority of the time that I was playing it, it was really enjoyable. But yeah, no, I am. Um, Phantom, he did complete his playthrough on his side. All right, let's put this back in there. Um, let's go grab some uh some fishies, some bladder fishies, and uh, then we'll we'll go to scary places, my friends. Oh, oh. The last time I came across some bladder fish, it was kind of down into like this, what do you call these? The, I'm blanking on the name of biomes now. It was down in here, it was down in here. I don't know if we're gonna find any more. 
but at least we found one right there. That one, that one was nice. Quite juicy. Um, hello. Any more bladder fishies down here? I know that there is also like some uh, some some bitey boys in here. I don't really like those. Speaking of bitey boys, oh, <laughs> I think that was a bitey boy in my face. <laughs> Sorry for noises. <laughs> All right, we have two bladder fish. Um, I'd really like one more. Right here. Here we go. Ask and you shall receive. Thank you, Mr. Bladderfish. Much appreciated. Much appreciated, sir. All right, so yeah, let's go back here. We'll... Let's grab a peep or two. That would be smart. We'll grab a peeper. We'll make uh, some food. We'll make some water. And then we'll get ready for our scary expedition. <sighs> So again, uh, our last step module goes, ooh, there's another one over here. Our last step module goes down to a thousand meters. So I really do wonder what the max depth is on uh, on the, uh, the biomes. I'm trying to think. So when we had to stop going downward, we had just gotten to 650 meters. So assuming this goes down to a thousand meters, there's like potentially like 350 meters that we still haven't explored. And like, that's like honestly kind of terrifying because I don't like, I just, I don't know what's like even further downward. It could be some more of those um, black snake looking leviathans. It could be something even worse. I don't know. Yeah, we'll see. We'll see. Okay, cool beans. So let's uh, let's do some sleeps, and then we'll go and and see some scary stuffs. Gonna need the hands. Gonna need the handholds. <sighs> deep breaths. Deep breaths. Okay. All right. Big stretch, lady face. Big stretch. All right, and here we go. And, uh, yeah, I know all these are, like, grown in now. It's, like, not, uh, organized whatsoever. So I gotta do something about that. But that's for a later time. That's for a later time. And I need to test out the horsepower thing that we got. If that's just, like, an automatic thing. Or, um, I also need to repair. Let me go ahead and do that. All right, sweet. So I don't know if this is an automatic thing or like I have to like use it. Let's go ahead and like test it out. No, nope, it's an automatic thing. Okay, all right. Because if it wasn't, I would have to like select it kind of like I did that that uh, second one on the bottom just now, but it won't let me select the other one. So yeah, it just must, I'm assuming makes us go faster. It's like kind of, hard to tell without having like a like a speed meter a sp speed meter a speedometer as you fancy folks call it <laughs> but um i'm assuming so i'm assuming so or like maybe if we actually had modules on the back maybe it would like pull them easier but we don't have those we don't have modules either we're not fancy like that not yet the only one that I have like a full thing of is the aquarium. But again, I really wish that I had like the fabricator and the storage one. And before we complete this like entire playthrough without like getting either of those, I'd be so sad. <sighs> but assuming that, you know, like um, the, the parts of like Alan's like vessel that we need to make are like an indicator of like how far along in the story. We we know that we're at least 33% of the game um, or through the game. I would imagine even further though, because there was a lot of stuff like beginning game before we even like found Alan and found out that we needed to, to like make a, a body for him. So we'll see, we'll see. All right, friends, back down we go. I'm not looking forward to this. Let's see if, um, how long it takes me to struggle to, to find the entrance again. I never know if it's like that way or if it's this way. I'm 
gonna attempt over here. Maybe. Cause this looks like a like a cave of sorts, but maybe it just goes like back out. Okay, I um this right? <laughs> I don't know. Maybe this is going back into the anemone. It is, it is. Gosh darn it, I took a wrong turn. All right, let's try that again. Thank you for the handhold, I appreciate it. Are you liking this game better than the first one? I wouldn't say better than the first one, um, but I wouldn't necessarily say that I'm liking it worse than the first one either. There's There's been like give and take um, with, uh, with like this one because you the the map isn't quite as large um as the the first Subnautica. so like i feel like it's like not as much to explore potentially not as many hours to put into the game um but they did really make some nice additions to like the um the ui and and that kind of stuff so that's been really nice we might be on the right track now Anytime we get into more of like this tunnelish type area, I, I feel like it, it's more promising. I wanted to see what was over here. I think I might already have these, but just to make sure. Yeah, we already had those, but just wanted to make sure. <laughs> Moving onward. Okay. Um, follow, follow the lights. There we go. <sighs> I don't like this, guys. I don't like this. Like, not only do we have to get back to where I was before, but we have to do so without, like, coming into contact with those dudes. That's going to be really hard. Go ahead and save. Let's just do that. I'm glad you're enjoying it. Oh yeah, it's been really good. It's been really good because like I love Subnautica. Obviously, like played it like several times. Would definitely do it again in the future. But you know, at the same time, it's nice to still have um, have like a new game that has you know that Subnautica feel because obviously it's a <laughs> Subnautica sequel. Um, but still be like new content and new to you, a new adventure. So I really can't wait to see what else they continue to do. I think the, the devs have already said that um, they plan on making another Subnautica game. But, you know, understandably so, I think they also want to focus on um, some other games, too, that are not, like, Subnautica related. And I really hope that they continue to get, like, all the support that they deserve because, you know, I just... I really would like to see what other, um, you know, like ideas they have in the works. Okay, I know that there was a, a scary dude, like, over there. And again, I, I just don't know. I don't know where the entrance was to, um, if it was down in that crevice. Is there anything in the crevice? Was it over there? That it looks like there's something down there. I, I think it's I think it's down there, but I also think that he's down there, so that's a problem. Just trying to get down here without being eaten. The fact that I'm not seeing him or hearing him right off the bat also makes me nervous. Because it's like, I know he's here. It's just so crazy how many, like, uh, propulsion cannon arm type things are, uh, are here. I heard him. Oh, I heard him. I heard him. Oh, I, I, I know. Oh, why am I out of my ship? Oh, I just, oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> Oh, I know. Oh, why am I out of the ship? How do I get back in the ship? Oh, I'm just... Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay, get back in the ship. Oh, okay. All right. Okay, just shock the living daylights out of him. Oh. <laughs> I 
I will- No! No! I hit it too soon! I hit it too soon! No! No! Go! Go away! Go away! Go! Shoot! Get out of my zone! I, I'm glad I brought a first aid kit. I really should have brought a second one. Oh, he's coming! He's coming! He's coming! He's a big boy. He's a very big and scary boy. Don't like him. Don't like him at all. Oh, shall we drink some water? But yeah, no, I, I should have brought a... Another first aid kit. I, I really wasn't um, planning on me like jumping out of my seat truck like right when the dude was there. Wasn't my my smartest play, my smartest hiccup. Is it through here? Is this where it is? This looks promising. I think this is right. I think this is right. Yes, because we're nearly at 650 meters. This is where I left off, guys. But I need to be careful because I know that there's another dude down here. Oh, God. Oh, I hate this. I hate this so much. Maybe before we go like any further, maybe I'll just get out and like do like a little bit of a, a repair real quick. Does that sound okay? Oh. Uh, Ted, welcome in. How's it going? Yeah, no, that's that's what I found to be the best way of dealing with that guy. Just, like, electrifying the living daylights out of him. But, you know, I just, I would prefer the method of not coming into contact with him whatsoever. But unfortunately, that's just not always the most viable option. Do I go that way? Or, like, there? it looks like there's some stuff over here, too. But maybe it just kind of like all leads back to the same place. Oh, guys. Oh, I'm so nervous. I wish they didn't grab you. It makes me panic. Yeah, no, it's it's kind of like the Reaper in that regard. Like, obviously, they're like grabbing you in a different way, but. Oh, oh, this is, uh, this is not what I need. This is not what I need. That's where I, I went before. Shit, now I'm turned around. Um, that's where I went before. And it was kind of like that, that cache there that it seemed like you could get a lot of stuff with the prawn suit. Let me drink my tea. Oh, I'm shaking. I saw him over there. I just, I, um, you know, I, I thought at this point, like, if we just go deeper, that's what we needed to do, but, like, it's kind of getting to a point where it's like, that's not what we need to do. Because I went down there and it... Yeah, it was just like drillable stuff. I don't want to go over there because I know he's over there. But I feel like I need to. Or is this going back upward? In this environment are confusing my sense okay, I'm hearing Alan. This is promising. Concern, there is something important to know. A facility. Uh, there or is. A body component. Perhaps both. <sighs> I cannot tell. Oh, guys. I'm not coming here for nothing, thank goodness. 
He said it's below. Okay, so we are going deeper. I just need to find the way. I'm so nervous. <laughs> I like, I know he's around here. Can I, um. I'm just like killing all the fishies here. Maybe it was like back there that I needed to go. Let me just get my shocker ready. Oh. He did say deeper, right? Which would make sense. Is this something? No, this is where I was before with the with the geysers. Okay. He said that there's a body part or a facility or both. Somewhere like in the in the area. And if it's here, I'm I'm just missing it. Oh, had to take a break from the game. My hands are shaking. I feel you. Like my whole body is shaking right now. Breaks are important. Breaks are very important. I'm proud of you, friend. going through my water pretty quickly. Like, there's no way to, like, get into it, like, from here, is there? <gasps> there is! There is! Oh my god, it's, like, straight down! Don't like that! Why do we have to do this? This is horrible! Oh! <laughs> Just go ahead and save. Let's just go ahead and save before we just go any no deeper and do. Oh, la 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 all right, we're on the right track, but I just don't know if there's any more of the like scary boys down here. So I'm just trying to be very cautious. I might already torpedo arm. All right, now we have it all. Okay. Don't like this, friends. Don't like this. All right. Some more kyanite here. Ah! <gasps> look! Look! Here it is! Oh, glorious day. Can I, like, get my sea truck through here? Or... That's... Okay. All right. That answered that question. <laughs> All right. Let's leave you right here. Hands are going through here. Like, surely they, they they can't have a dude in here because he can't swim. He can't swim. Right? <laughs> I, I better not see any leviathans, like, breaking through the floor here. Holy moly. Look at this, guys. This is crazy. Wow. 
Is there anything down here? Or oh, I'm just hurting myself. Don't mind me. No, I think this is kind of a dead end. All right. This is this is beautiful and insane. I know we had like an ice worm earlier. There better be no like crystal crystal worms coming out. <laughs> Ooh, ooh, what the heck are you? Architect components. I don't... Architect constituent parts. Oh! Architect Our organs! Given your current location, I think they could still be improved. Your feedback has been noted. I've never been so excited for organs. All right, so we're gonna need some more kyanite. So I'll, I think I do have some extra at home, but we'll probably grab some extra just in case on the way. I'm assuming that that was the only thing down here, which is like something pretty juicy. He did say like a like a base and a body part. So I'm I'm assuming that this is it. Okay, all right. Yeah, I'm not seeing like anything new on my beacon. I, I just wanted to make sure about that. All right, cool. That was uh, that was pretty juicy if I do say so myself. So we only need one more body part, guys. And again, the only thing that I can think of that there has to be something juicy somewhere is where we found that ice worm because when I was there, I I couldn't. I was I was trying to think for the life of me. I'm like, like what is here? I feel like I've seen everything, but obviously, oh, who is it? Have found two of the three I have, I have. Want to tell me where the third one is? This is as close as I have come to autonomy in a long time. You have such a way with words. Is that? Sarcasm. Is she was. flirting with him? You're learning. Hopefully, I will not have time to complete my study. <laughs> I was wondering if you can transfer bodies. Why was it important to find a cure when you were infected? Couldn't you just make a new body? As you can see in the components you have scanned thus far, the forms we require combine biological and mechanical parts. Okay. The tissues you have scanned were developed from the DNA of 27 separate alien species. 27. That's what a crazy. juicy number. And wouldn't that mean that anything that infects a body you've manufactured can potentially learn how to infect all those other species? Yes. That is why a cure was imperative. Was that a dude? Was that a was that a scary dude? Well, I was hoping he would give us a little more information there, but it was basically like, hey, you found two parts. Give yourself a pat on the pat. Pat on the back, GG, GG. I just, I was trying to see if there was any more in this big crystal area. Is there something over here? Um, it might just lead back around. I also want to see if I can like scan these. Doesn't seem like it. Um, yeah, I think this is just leading back around to the other side. Okay, um, let's grab that kyanite there. I'm being just like a little like too ballsy now. I'm just like banking and hoping that like those big scary dudes can't get like down into this specific area. Jamima, thank you so much again for that raid earlier. I appreciate you so much, friend. You guys have just been so amazing with just like all the welcomes back and making me feel all just like warm and special and fuzzy inside. I hope you get some really good sleep tonight. Lower back and Lexi's are uh, stiff from shoveling. I'm sure. I'm sure, man. How long uh, were you guys out there and, and doing all the gardening and stuffs? Even just like a little bit of that will go a long way. Was it this way? Or maybe it was more like straight upward. This is definitely going somewhere. Um, 
I don't really remember coming this way. Is this... Yikes. Here's some kyanite. We'll take that. Was this the way I came? Or is this like a second entrance? Maybe it was the way I came. I just didn't remember going through that like that that like tunnel there. Okie dokes. Yeah, I guess I did. Alright. Back out we go, friends, into like the, the scary place with the big baddies. Oh, it was so nice, like just having like a small break from them. Speaking of which, speaking of which. Like he can't come like down into here, right? But he like definitely knows where I am. That's not cool. Yeah, he's right there. Awesome. Just get the shocker ready. Oh, all afternoon, jeez, man. I hope that tomorrow is more restful for you. You deserve it, my friend, you deserve it. Play some games, read a book, watch some shows. Oh, speaking of shows, Dave, I meant to tell you, we uh, we finished all, all the four seasons that are on US Netflix of uh, Better Call Saul. We watched uh, the rest of it last night. So yeah, it'll be interesting to see once they do add on uh, the fifth season to uh, US Netflix. Um, we also, coincidentally, also finished Broadchurch last night. Oh, it was like so like sad to have it come to an end because oh, it was so good. I don't know where the dude is and I really don't like that. I'm gonna put maybe that marker. Can you like get down here? Oh, 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 oh
Um, is it Colton? Am I saying your name right? Daredevil? I don't know about that. I I am. I wouldn't say I'm really the Daredevil type. I'm more the cower in the corner in fear for an hour and just like, oh, just, oh, just okay. I hear just just critters and I don't like the critters. Oh, I like the Where's the pages? Ah! <laughs> Why didn't that shock him? No, no. Get out of here, you mother hacker. Oh, I knew he was around me. Is this the way? Please let me escape. Oh, this hellish place. Is it there? Is it here? I'm just going upward and hoping for the best. Oh, I'm doing good. I'm glad to hear it. I hope you had a lovely vacation. I did. I did. Thank you. Yeah, I know. Um, I think I have that. I'm just going to ignore it. Um... Yeah, Nick and I, we went to uh, to the beach, and we went on some other adventures. Um, we had some good noms, did some good shopping, we went to an escape room, had some good time with my fam. It was really good, it was really good. But yeah, glad to be back and hanging out with you Juicy Beans, too. I'm just, like, so disoriented right now. This place is- oh, didn't mean to quite do that. Okay, alright, wrong button. <laughs> Is it this way? I hope it's this way. I just... This doesn't look familiar. But maybe... We're going We're going really upward now. I, I feel like this is a good sign. I don't think this was the one that I went into, because... Yeah, this is the purple vents one. Okay, alright. Cool. Found this by mistake. Sweet. I'm just glad to be out of there. Cool beans. All right, so, um, yeah, I think we'll go turn this off. We'll go back to my base and I think we're gonna, I think we're gonna go, um, to, whatchamacallit, to the island. I think I'm, I'm gonna make another snow fox, um, since the, the, what you may call it the um the ice worm killed my last one but yeah i just need to be a lot more careful and i remember reading a pda thing someone mentioned using a thumper to like deter the um hello someone mentioned using a thumper to deter the words are hard deter the ice worms what is this here this might be something juicy. Um, so, ooh, a sleeper module fragment, cool. One out of three. Will I ever have a useful module? Find out next time on Dragon Ball Z. Um, but, oh, is this another one here? Okay, all right, cool beans, I'll take it. The one thing about the, the, uh, the thumper thing that I did read, Obviously, we don't have the blueprint for it yet, um, but it said, like, once you are able to make it, I think it its effect only lasts for, like, up to five minutes. Ooh, hi, boy. How you doing? Didn't realize that you were right there. Okay, all right. I'm just going to go back around this way. You didn't see anything. I mean, like, honestly, that, that boy is, like, a bit smaller than the than the other one that we've recently become friends with. But I still don't like him. I still don't like him. Oh. Oh. What's on my butt? This is fine. This is fine. Ah. <sighs> Okay, all right. Mm. <sighs> Chat cray 100%. <laughs> I have that one, but I haven't made it yet. Uh, those things uh, grab me a lot. Uh, that one ate me. I didn't have my truck. Oh no, Gwen. <sighs> yeah, no, luckily I haven't had that happen yet. And I, I say yet as if it's going to happen. Please don't let it happen, game. Please don't let it happen. But yeah, no, so I think our, um, 
game plan will be to go back to the base, get some uh, some food and some hydration. I'll make another snow fox. We'll head back to the what was it called? Um, Arctic something, where the ice worm was. And see, there's gotta be like I found that like you know what you know what guys. Actually, I was just thinking to myself what might be a better idea here. Because, um, when we were at that Arctic area before with the ice worm, I did find the primary alien teleporter gate thing that teleports to the secondary one on the other side of the island. Um, I was just wondering to myself which, I feel like it would be a lot easier to get back to the ice worm dude if I, if I go through that gate. Maybe. Um, genuine question here, guys. Can a snow fox go through? the the alien teleporting gates I really hope it does like the prawn suit could so I feel like these could like a snow fox could um all right, what would I need for another snow fox? I think it was pretty straightforward. It was pretty simple. Let's put some stuff away as well. Where did I have my stuff is the question. I think I had Kyanite in the bedroom. Um, If we're going back to the island, let's take the water purification tablets with us too. Um, boo, 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 boo. Hmm. So I don't have lithium. Where do I have lithium? Maybe that was over here too. It couldn't in early access, but you can. Oh, that's right. That's right, Lux. I completely forget that you can pick up the snow fox. I should know that based on what we experienced earlier. Thank you for the reminder there. Yeah, I think we'll um I think we'll go back through that gate then because I feel like I'm gonna find that area a little easier if I do it that way. Alright, put all of this in there. Didn't mean to put that battery away. Um I don't know if I'm going to need our peng our robo pengling thing anymore, but just in case we do, I'll I'll take that with us as well. We should probably take a flare with us in case we have an encounter with a, a, a whatchamacallit, a dude. Let's, um... Hmm. Trying to decide what I should do here. Um... Marble melon, marble melon, Chinese potato... I feel like the better source of hydration was these Preston plants. I wonder, do they like, I wonder if they regrow their fruits or if you have to like, just like cut it down and like make a new one. Oh, this is so inconvenient. Um, yeah, making that salad right about now would be like really helpful. Let's eat some of these, I suppose. Those those noises are slightly uncomfortable. <laughs> um, frost buys, marble melon. We'll uh, take this one, then we will cut this one and we'll replant those seeds or some of them at least eat that um all right just need a little bit more just a little bit more just a little more sustenance 
I guess we'll go ahead and eat some more of these Chinese potatoes. We'll replant this guy. Um, what do I need the frost pause plant for? Is that like just like a... Um, Iodine content useful for chemical applications. Okay. All right. Um, I'm just going to put that back in there for now. We'll put that away as well. Um, eat some more potatoes. Put that in there. Um, we'll uh, consume this and this and that. And this, I guess we can go ahead and do that um, other marble melon seed over here. All right, can I grab another one of these fruits, the Preston plant fruits? It's just like such like an awkward grab. I feel like it would be like a lot better if I had it in like a small planter. I should do that. All right, but that like ties us over for now with a uh, water and, and all that stuff. Repair tool. I'm not going to need the mineral detector with me, I, I don't think. Um, so we'll go ahead and put that away. What else? What else can we do? I think that's kind of it for now. Um, I mean, we're not going to need the sea glide on land. I mean, there's some times where you go into like the, the frigid waters, so maybe I should keep that on me. Um... Decisions, decisions. Okay, what would I need for that snow fox again? Snow fox, snow fox, snow fox, snow fox, snow fox. Um, you are right here. Okay, so um, two magnetite, battery, titanium, lube. That's pretty heckin' straightforward, if I do say so myself. Hmm. Have you taken any uh, cool in-game photos yet? I haven't, I haven't, but I would definitely like to. I would definitely like to. I'd be really interested to know as well um, how many uh, like different plants there are in the game that you can, you know, plant, as the name implies. Because, you know, like I did that in my last playthrough of original Subnautica and I just, I loved it, I loved it. So it would be really cool to have like a plant of each thing, but I really need to separate them out because I'm not doing a good job with my uh, with my organization right now, at all. Uh, found it by accident, GG, GG, Gwen. I took a screenshot, but it was also an accident, nice. <laughs> all right, so we have the, we have the lube. Let's get, I should have magnet, yeah, I have, I have a, definitely enough magnetites. We'll take a couple of those. Let's go get a titanium. And, um, I think we make it, like, on that base that we have on land, right? It's a bike and it hovers. I think we, we do it there. Like, we don't do it, like, from our mobile vehicle bay or anything like that. Yeah, that wouldn't make sense. All right, so let's go back to our handy dandy sea truck and let's uh, let's do some stuff, my friends. Maybe I should get like a little more hydration before we go, a little more food. Yeah, let's do that really quick. Let's do that. Back in our base we go with my sea glide. Perfect. Switch had a lot of screenshots. I accidentally took, I do that all the time with my, my Switch. I'm glad it, it's not just me. Um, where am I even going right now? Not the place that I intended on going. Because, yeah, no, just like the button. It's just like right there. And like I always like hit it. I'm so clumsy, thumbsy. <laughs> can I, can I get the, can I get the thing? Hello? Hello? Um. Oh, no. Um, it doesn't help that like kind of like the hitbox for the fruit is like a little off. I noticed that earlier. Let's go ahead and um, I was about to say make some of the the other planters. I need my habitat builder for that though, and I don't have that on me. Let's 
Let's just go grab a fish. Let's just do it. Got 84 hydration. Um, I mean, I do have a water on me right now. We're fine. We're fine. It's fine. Totally fine. Cool beans. We're good. Let's do it. I guess I could grab a peeper before we go. Nah. <laughs> Don't quote me on that, friends. You heard me say nah. When I probably should have been saying yeah. All right. So we're going to... um, Where are we going to? We're going to... um. It's been so long since I've, I've been to the the island area since like that was like all I did in the beginning of the game. I think it's just, like kind of like straight north northwest somewhere around there. I believe. You know what? If we go into our blueprints or not our blueprints, our beacons yeah, here. Oh, Sarah. Sarah. Holy hacking eight months. Oh, Sarah, thanks so much for eight months. Guys, can we get some hype and chat for our friend Sarah? Sarah, welcome back to the sub family, friend. I really appreciate it. So I hope you enjoy your badge, your emotes, the special role in the Discord. How are you doing, friend? It's good to see you. I missed all of you guys when I was on the vacations and stuffs. Also, Gwen, thanks for the reminder to save too. That's a, a juicy idea if I do say so myself. Um, so yeah, it's a lot more this way. I mean, granted, that's more that way, but I feel like the entrance that we need to get to is a little more kind of in this direction, I'm thinking. I think so. I hope so. We'll see. Been so busy. Uh, looking forward to vacation. We both need it. I know, I know, Sarah. I, remind me, like, when are you guys leaving? Was it like 1st of June or something like that? That you and Lauren are excited. Everybody needs a break now and then, that's for sure. On Friday! Oh, it's so close, so close. Sarah, I hate that, like, I just got back from vacation and now you're just leaving. <laughs> we can't, we can't catch each other. But I hope that you have a wonderful trip. It'll be good, it'll be good. I hope you take lots of pics, too. Alrighty. So, the little entrance, little, uh, little divot in the ice should be pretty close to here. If I don't run into any of these eye jelly dudes. Oh man. Um, for those of you that may have missed it in the, um, the beginning of the playthrough, you can catch it on a, um, I've been uploading the playthrough to, to YouTube and that kind of thing, but First time I uh, tried to build a base, I tried to build it around those jelly dudes. Didn't work out too well. Didn't work out too well. <laughs> All right, out we go. Let's make our handy dandy snow fox again. I have the hover pad right over here. Oh, it's so weird being on land again since like I just, yeah, haven't done it in a hot minute. Okie dokes. So yeah, I think my course of action is going to be going back to the Phi Robotics landing pad because there's a secondary teleporting uh, gate platform there. And you can use that to get to the other side because I feel like that will put us closer to the ice worm if I remember right. But I could be wrong there because again, it, it's been a hot minute. It's been a hot minute. All right, here we go. Hey, Drago, thanks for the reminder to save, too. Probably a good time since we uh, just made our snow fox again while it's still alive. Thank you for the posture check. Oh, and thank you for the hydration. I hope that you guys are taking care of yourselves, too. I wish I could uh, take a vacation. I've only been uh, a porter since the end of April, and I'm already tired. Bless your heart, Gwen. You're just, like, always working so hard. I really hope that you can get some some time to yourself tune. Two? Two? Tune? I think I was trying to say like two and like soon at the same time. Don't mind me. I'm just a silly billy. Um, but yeah, I know like, because I know like you like just got the new job and like, you know, in between there, like not really <laughs> any time for break whatsoever. So make sure to take advantage of any days you have off and that kind of thing. It's so important. Which is hard when you need to do like adulting and stuff on uh on those days too. 
I like I, I preach it, but it's it's a uh, it's hard to live by for sure. Cause uh, like especially like with all the wedding planning and stuff, um, and trying to do that like on top of like you know everyday life and chores and and streaming and, and and YouTube's and all that. Yeah, it's been a little difficult. Been a little difficult. Trying to find where the entrance was. Oh, oh, just going a little off course here. Don't mind me. Was it actually up there? Yeah, I think it was up there. All right, so I'm going to pick. You. Oh no, I'm. I'm gonna pack you up. <laughs> Let's try that again. Oh, oh, while I'm here, I should look for um, those uh, like the pepper plant things, so that I can like grow some of those and we can make salad. Um, I think there was one of those, like, pepper plants, um, like, somewhere over there, I think. So let's go see about that. Would it be connected to this? Dangerous weather approaching. Seek shelter. I'm working on it. I think there was some in here. Was this... Was it this? Beaver pepper. Yes, it is. All right. Glad we established that, friends. So, do I just... Do I just have to plant one? Is this the equivalent of a seed? I'm assuming that I can plant this. Because it doesn't seem like I can get a seed from it. So, hopefully we can. Hopefully we can. Uh come into the office and work uh, headed home but i just wanted to say hi always appreciate that and the resub friends please be careful on your way back home had to do all of it at least thank you draco appreciate you <laughs> those eye jellies look Subnautica Loki trying to like kill me over here. Don't mind me guys. Don't mind me. All right. Um, let's just proceed this way Try to escape with our lives um, Yeah, no the jellies they they like I think they look like cool because I like jellyfishes except for like the whole um, Eye situation those are a little creepy um, I think I've already gotten yeah, I can't get that All right, and I've got my snow fox. Yes. So, um, yeah, we'll see how close we are to the, to the ice, uh, worm and the, the Arctic, was it the spires? I think it was back up that way. Oh, that was a weird, like, lighting glitch. And, like, obviously we found this, like, this alien base thing over here. But I haven't really found anything else on this side of the island. He can't like come in here, right? I wasn't expecting to hear him like already and I really don't like that. All right. Is this like a tunnel over here? Or is it just leading downward? I think it's just leading downward. So he didn't like my snow box when I had that. I'm wondering if I'm like quiet and just walking along, if like he'll be any nicer. Just go ahead and save. There's like something over there. I, I can't remember. I think I tried to scan that before. All right, so far so good. Oh, oh, not good, not good, not good. Hi. Okay, so note to self, walking along does not help. He's still like really aggro. Oh. So maybe I should just like go ahead and get my um my snow fox out. He oh 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 
Oh, oh. That was weird. I was like stuck. I it kind of seemed like he was underneath me, and I really didn't like that. <laughs> yeah, no, there's like no escaping the terror, that's for sure. Just like kind of like trying to stick to the edges. You know what I just noticed? I didn't put back on my um my helmet. That would have helped with me like not freezing to death. Whoopsies. Completely forgot about that. Oh, oh. Stay away, sir. Please. It kind of seems like I need to go down there. Or... M it kind of looks like I can, like, jump across there. But I don't have the jump thing on my... on my thing. Crap. Oh, man. I... I bet you I'm going to need that. I, like, obviously they wouldn't have, like, a jump module if you didn't need it, right? So I just, I kind of feel like I need... I kind of feel like I need to go back and, like, make it. At least we're not freezing to death right now. Hmm. Hey, Teleman, welcome in. How's it going? It's, like, so, like, low visibility right now. It sucks. Was this was the only entrance, right? It didn't like go out on any other side. Um, no, I don't think this is right. I think this was when we were first like going into the Arctic like spires area. Um, I don't know where our previous entrance was. Oh, great and you, glad to hear it. I'm doing well, doing well, thanks. Yeah, no, just uh, got back from vacation not long ago. Um, and it was really good, it was really good, but glad to be back and hanging out with you guys too. All right, I think, um, it kind of looks like there's like supposed to be like something behind here, but I don't know of any way of like melting this. Like, using my thermal blade on it, but it doesn't really seem like it's working. Alright, this is, yeah, this is leading back to there. I just, I kind of, like, wanted to explore and see if I needed that hover, um, the jump thing for sure. Before I, like, went all the way back, but... It's just like, it's so hard to like see and explore right now. Is there like any way to get like on top of there? Get some more heat. Oh, holy, oh jeez! Do you guys see that? He like went into the cave. Didn't like that. Oh. At least we can see now. At least we can see. All right. Who is this man? Um, Lord of Peacocks. I like the name. Thanks for the follow. How's it going? You just found Thank Omega Base. Oh Take man. Shanker. Yeah, I've I've still been looking for that myself. No. But GG, GG. Like, it kind of looks like you would get across there. But I don't know. Or, like, or there to there. 
Or maybe this. I just, I don't know. I don't know. Okay, all right. This is like the central area. Leave me alone, sir. Nothing to see over here. He's looking at me. There's like a, a, a bridge or something up there. Oh, how do we get up there? How do we get up there, guys? There's something. Oh, how? How do? Okay, it looks like if you were like up top, you could get there. I jumped down here, so maybe I shouldn't have done that. Um, don't think there's any way for me to get there from like here. Excuse me, part of me coming through. Nothing to see here. There's like some ladders and stuff up there. Oh. This is leading back to over here. Um. Can I go up like this way? Oh, oh, oh. It kind of seemed like it. Have I been up there before? This is like going downward. Well, we can get some heat down here at the very least. This is like very obviously like an ice worm cave and I just, I don't feel the most secure about being down here. I don't know if I've been through here before. Close off our egg. Oh, it's just okay. Oh, hi, It's just okay. Oh, I just, I'm about to die. I'm kind of like stuck in place for some reason. Am I like stuck in here? Okay, this like melted. I want to see what's over there. Oh, there's like a lot of copper down here. Can I get through here? Oh. Okay. All right. I hear a dude. And I. Oh, okay. There's the dude. All right. Um. Well, I was hoping that that would, like, get me, like, higher up. It really didn't seem like that was the case. Like, I saw, like, a place that we could get up there. I just don't know how to do it. I've, I've never, like, had to use one of these, but... he Go, 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 go away! Go, shoot! Oh, it actually worked! Cool beans! Yeah, I've never had to use one of those before. Granted, I've never really had them on me. <laughs> and didn't know at first that they were scared of them. Oh, he's coming! Oh, Lord, he's coming! Um, let's go ahead and like turn those into water. Might as well drink that. Drink this. Should probably go ahead and eat that too. Maybe I should have brought another nutrient block. Excuse me. Pardon me. Nothing to see here. Have I have I been up here? Oh, I don't know. <sighs> I have not been up here. Okay, battery. 
Um, I was just talking about nutrient blocks and a first aid kit. Okay, all right. Um, oh, and we have these too. It's probably gonna take up a lot of inventory space. Yes, it is. Um. Go ahead and do that for body heat. All right, now what? I was kind of expecting more up here, but we had some juicy stuff up here. Like, oh, this is not a good time to be coming down here. Oh, okay. All right. Go away, Mr. Stalker, dude. Go, go, shoot. Go, go, get out of here. Go, go. Go. All right. So, like, the last time I was here, I did take my, like, snow fox over that way. There were, like, a lot more stalkers. Um, this is just, like, another way of getting through. Hmm. Oh, go away, go away. Oh, this is fine, this is fine. Have I been through here? This is like such a maze. Oh, oh, there's something juicy, something juicy, friends. First aid, battery, um, is that it? Oh, guys. Oh, data box. Hello. New technology acquired. Snow Fox Ice Worm Attack Reduction Module. Okay. Well, that would have probably been, like, more helpful to have early on, but I don't know if we need all of these first aid kits. At least right now. At least right now. All right, we're still going upward. Can you eat the snow? I don't think you can eat the snow, but there is this thing in the game I would show you, but I've already used them all up. Um, we're like, it'll turn the snow into water, and so that's why we have these large filtered waters in here. So that's been really nice. Guys, it, we're, we're going upward, and so either this is leading somewhere that we need to go, or it's just leading back to, like, how we got here in the first place. Oh, but now it's leading back down! Oh no! This is, like, maybe not so promising. There's like so many ladders here. It's like, which one do I take? Um, that just like drops down there. Okay, so there's like a bunch of like lithium or something in there that I'm like not able to grab. Okay, inventory is not full, right? Not quite, not quite. I should be able to get some more heat in here. Maybe? Maybe not? Um... Was this a dead end? Really? Ah, oh, come on game. Work with me here. Uh, let's go ahead and eat that. It looks like something should be here. <sighs> Gosh diggity darn it. All right, let's uh, go down here. Um, go back this way. It's like a lot of drillable stuff around here. All right, we'll try to go up here and see if I've gone up this ladder. Okay, I think I just came from there. Yeah, I did. Have I been through here? Mm. I should have, like, stuck around that place where, like, Alan said, like, there's something, like, juicy here. I think that's where I was before, I think. Um, 
Because I don't even remember where that was now. All right, that's where I like was trying to get er up earlier and I couldn't do that. Um, let's eat another one of those guys. Uh, um, I just, I feel like I might need that, that jump um, module or whatever it was, I think. Cause I am all sorts of confuzzled. Yeah, no, now we're like, just like back. Okay, all right, excuse me, sir. Pardon me, coming through. Now we're just like at the, the bottom again. Um, and I just don't know where I'm going. Was this going over towards the stalker dudes again? Yeah, there's a stalker right over there. Like, here, let me go ahead and get... Well, maybe I should wait so it doesn't, like, burn out. Because if that burns out, that's going to really suck. There's, like, no way to, like, get behind here, right? Almost looks like you can get up there, but... Go away, sir! Shoo! Shoo! Go home! Go! You are scared of this flare! That's right! Go! Go on with your bad self. <laughs> I guess we can go ahead and get some more of these. Inventory full. Okay. All right. That's that. He's like coming back over here. Shoot. 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 Ooh, 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 ooh. Okay. All right. <laughs> Big baddie. Oh. Yeah, yeah. Neither of us want a piece of that action. Oh. It's just like kind of weird to me that there's this like back section of this area. I'm not like seeing like what you could um like what there is like back here even. Like, the only thing that I saw was, like, that frozen, like, wall. Whoa! Cool. He came out of nowhere. I knew there were multiple back here. Yeah, there's another one right there. Go, go, shoot, shoot. That's right. Have I been through this one? I don't know where I've been and where I haven't been at this point. Oh, oh, oh. Uh, hello? <laughs> I don't know what that was. Hey, Manny, how's it going? Uh, oh, good, snow. I've never seen that before. Yeah, no, no snow in, in Minnesota, that's for sure. How are you? It's good to see you. Is this? Oh, I have been here before. Okay. Yeah, there's like all that drillable ion there. I think we got enough ion cubes at home. I just really wish I, I knew where he said that we were close. Wherever it was, I saw like a um, like a landing like pad with stuff on it like up above. I do remember that. It's getting like dark again too, which sucks. Is that a alien something another over there? Or maybe it's just one of those, like, it kind of like looked like green and glowing. Maybe that was just like a glitch or me seeing things, one of the two. I think this is gonna lead back out to the other side, which is not the way that I wanna go. Or maybe not. Um... Hmm. I wish I had some of that snow. It's hot in my house right now. Yeah, no, it's been like really humid here too. So I feel ya, I feel ya. 
Like, maybe I'm just, like, supposed to, like, follow those green things. But it's, like, so hard to see where they're leading. Because, like, obviously, like, the wires and stuff are, like, under the snow. So that doesn't help too much. I'm gonna try, like, one more time, friends, and... If I can't find it this time, I think I'll have to, like, go back um, and see about making that, that module and see if we can get anywhere that way. All right, that's, like, leading into to here. So I'm going to go this way. Hi, sir. How's it going? I kind of need to get down there. This might hurt a little bit. Yeah, actually, that was fine. Cool beans, cool beans. Gentle landing. <sighs> okay, um... So we continue down here. And I think it was around here that Alan told us that it was close. Or maybe not. <gasps> it was, it was, it was right here. Okay. <sighs> maybe I have actually been up there before because it does look like that crate is open. He said, he said we were close. He said we were close. I just can't see shit right now. All right, here's another one over here. Okay, all right. Continuing this way. Maybe I should have the flare with me just in case. Um... Is that another one over there? I don't want the flare to burn out, though. That's the thing. My snow box would probably be helpful here. I do- Oh! Ah, no! Um, we need to take this. Okay, alright. This is fine. This is fine. Need to eat one of those. I should have brought some more flares. <gasps> Wait a minute, hang on, hang on. Oh, oh, is this something, guys? Oh, I think this is something. <sighs> How did I not see these the first time? I just need to follow them better. <sighs> I think we're on to something here, my friends. <gasps> There's something here. I was, oh. I was so worried that we needed to, like, go and get, like, a thing. <sighs> Where's my scanner? Large emerald. It's beautiful. Hope there's no stalkers in here. Is this... Oh, no, that's emerald. All right, um... Hello? Base, you got something for me? That's interesting. <gasps> Architect component? Is this, is this, is this it? Architect! Ah, that is a rough way to go. Yes, I would not enjoy being crushed while mining iron cube components. The coal preserved the body well, but this isn't a big sample. Will it be enough? Oh. Uh, uh, derived from the DNA of various species, capable of changing form as necessary. Ah, like stem cells. So, what prevents you from, I don't know, ending up with hooves where your eyelashes should go? That does not happen. At least not since the fourth generation. <laughs> what happened during the first three? You have scanned all the components we need. Oh. Are you excited? Using the chemical compounds available in your body, I am able to approximate what you might call cautious optimism. Oh, guys, we have all three parts. What do we need for the last one? I was like, I was like right here before, like at the beginning of the game. Um, I was I was in this area and just like didn't follow the the green lights well enough. 
Root, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. Root what? Root posh, posh, pustule? Root pus? What? Where can I find root push tool? I don't think I've come across that yet. Oh no. And here I was, I was hoping that um, we were just like, you know, in an area maybe that like, or that we'd gotten like all the things and like, but yeah, no. Oh, okay. Well, at least for the synthetic fiber, we have the, the spiral plant now. What was the deal with polyaniline? Hydrochloric, I've already got like a hydrochloric acid uh, in my storage. Root pustule. Um... Like, I, since we got this one from land, I can't help but wonder if the root pustule comes from something on land, but... Data bank. We're going to look at, uh, let's look in this first. Sleeper module, um, geological data, large emerald. Pure emerald is typically colorless. These large crystals contain trace amounts of chromium leading to the development of the distinctive green color seen here. Mining activity near these crystals suggests that they are valued for the applications in architect technology. I guess that makes sense based on the color. Uh, architect constituent parts are effectively tissue. Okay, so this is just like kind of like giving you a rundown on like the the parts that he needs for his body. All right, but what I want to look at is what do I want to look at geological data, maybe. Um, no. Um, indigenous life forms, yes. I want to look at the flora and see if there's like anything that I've I've already scanned that I could maybe get the the pustules from. Such a such a bad word, pustules. I hate that. <laughs> Crete vine, fevered flowering. I mean, that like kind of looks like the pustules that came from the anemones. What I'm going to do is unpin all of that and then repin those. Root pustule. So, based on the name, one would believe that, in fact, it does come from a root. I know, shocker. Um, I mean, there's like those, um, like root looking things in the like underneath the lily pad biome it like it seems like it's something that you could maybe like grab off of it i need to go back and look at those i don't think it would be in land ornamental plant Frost Akasha. Is it this? Because that kind of looks like that. Unusual multi-trunk trees, highly adapted to the harsh conditions of the glacial environment. Nutrient sources are infrequent and limited to the glacier, and these trees create fast-growing root systems. Roots. Um, that search out rocky material trapped in the ice. The dense foliages, uh, foliage captures energy from the sun via photosynthesis and provides a sheltered environment for growth of its bioluminescent fruit. I feel like that's like, the, um, that's kind of like the, my, my biggest guess right now. 
because it really did look like it. And it even mentioned root in the... Like, my only um, thought as to why that might not be it is because it's not listed under exploitable. So I don't know if I would even be able to, like, harvest from it. But the trees, oh gosh, I'm trying to even remember how to get back to them. Um, it was like in a certain part of this side of the island. I might be a bitch trying to, uh, to find again. Like plants, red stalks. Sorry, I'm getting behind on chat, guys. Just trying to catch up um, and, and see what what it could possibly be but that's that's my first guess if it's not that my next guess would probably be like the um like underneath the the lily pad biome or like underneath like the twisty bridges or something all right let's let's go see what we can find i'm just really glad that we found this place oh oh hmm The spores, I like, uh, I use them as outdoor lights. Yeah, no, I really like anything that like has like the bioluminescence to it and glows. I think it's so pretty. I kind of did the same thing with um, like the kelp vine at my base in OG Subnautica. We kind of got the same thing going at our, um, at our, where does this go to? At our current base, but it's just a lot less organized. Ooh, okay, there's this dude. At least it's like light out right now, that's good. Oh, he <laughs> just like headbutt me. <laughs> I guess that's what happens when the game registers that, um, whoa, hello. When the game registers that, um, okay, all right. That you've already um, got your, 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 um, whatchamacallit out, your flare. Oh, uh, are you asking us if it's that? No, no, I'm just, I'm just speculating here. But thank you, thank you for asking. Yeah, no, if, um, whatever game I'm playing, um, but, like, especially with this playthrough, um, if there ever is a time that, like, I, like, genuinely am looking for a, an answer from you guys, I'll specify it by saying, um, genuine question here. So, yeah, thank you, thank you for asking. I might be able to pull out my snow fox here. Maybe. Let's try it. Let's see. Where does this lead to? This might just lead back around. I'm just really glad that we found that last part. Just now trying to find those pustules. Like, I just like... I feel like it's like probably something that like I've been to before because I feel like I've been to most of if not like all the areas in the game right now. I shouldn't say all of. Probably most of. Oh, so this leads back to here. Oh, okay. I remember seeing this ice wall and I'm like there's got to be something here. All right. Back down we go. Oh, okay. That probably would have been like a little like easier of a fall if I like actually rode with my snow fox. But oh well, oh well. Um, let me get rid of this guy. Cause he's being a butt face. Get out of here, sir. You just go on. You're just like a big doggo meanie face. <laughs> oh, all right. Um, let's put that back away. And I'll see if I can. Oh, hello. Okay, all right. Don't mind me. Nothing to see here. Where did this lead to? Because I know one of these led to like the other side of. Maybe I'll be relatively safe here. Relatively. I'm just like trying to find that area with the trees again, just to see if it's that. 
Um, I think technically we're still in the area with the... Uh, yeah, I think we're still in the area with the... Oh, yeah, we're still in the area with the ice worm. All right, okay, glad we established that. Okay, all right, coming through, don't mind me. All right, I will take... Oh, nope, not like that. Never like this. We'll pack up you. Um, ooh, okay, um... Problem is, I don't know how to, to get there. It's probably, no, this is a dead end, awesome. Um, can I actually get back up here? Oh, come on, oh man, I gotta go through here, crap. Okay, all right, um, hmm. Oh, and this was a dead end too, cruddy crud nuggets. All right, how to... get to... Um, I'm gonna eat some of these so that we can get some of our hydration up a little bit. How to get back to that area? Because if I remember right, when we first came here, I had to go through the tree area to get to here. I'm just, I'm like trying to think where that would even be. Why robotics is already on here. So maybe it's more that way? Hmm, so hard to say. Oh, okay. Um, that's leading to over there. I don't think there was anything else down here, right? Oh, well, maybe there was something down here. Where is this going to? Alright, this is just leading back out somewhere. It's so loud and scary. All right, okay, okay, getting a little stuck. I think it might time be time for a, another first aid kit here. Let's go ahead and do that. All right, I think, um, what is this? What do I think? I think that this is very uh, cloudy and spoopy. <gasps> this might be it. Maybe. No, no, this is putting us back out here. Oh no, this is not what I was looking for. Darn it. Um. It's okay, boy. I'm friendly. Ooh, ooh. I wasn't expecting to come up here. It kind of looks like this is like a dead end. I just don't know how to get back there. This is very, very peculiar, very interesting. Um, also, Nizodam, nice to see you. How's it going? I hope that you're having a great day. Oh, I'm just trying to find the way back to the trees at the moment. You know what I think would be really cool? If like, when you would like scan something, I mean like I can see how this could be like easily like exploitable, but like something like the tree, like you know, if like you would scan the tree before you could see like their location again or something like that, I don't know. What's over here? Oh, this is another uh, entrance for, for the uh, pangling dude. I don't know if it's gonna have anything I need in here at this point, but. Might as well check, right? That scared me. Um, okay, so let's get... Uh, do, 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 that. And we'll... Um, go into this mode. See if there's anything juicy in here for us. I'm assuming I haven't been in here before. There's quartz. Um, there's more quartz. Is it just quartz? Is it just quartz in here? 
maybe I have been in this one. I, I really don't remember doing that. Um, but otherwise, this is a really underwhelming cave. That kind of sucks, Major Butt. Mm, how to adjust the air conditioning? Yeah, no, you stay cool. Stay cool, my friend. Hmm, okay. Well, we'll, uh... We'll do that. Um, we'll remember to take our pingling back this time. Because I don't always remember to do that. I'm just like so disoriented, guys. Nothing to see here. Excuse me. Pardon me. This may have. Oh, I think this is leading back to the alien base. I think. Well, there's the ion cubes there. Okay. All right. So this is not the teleporty. <sighs> um, let's go ahead and eat those to get some hydration. We'll take, um, these with us too. Alright. Um. Hmm. Rochelle, thanks for keeping me hydrated, friend. No more distractions done with meetings than work for the day. I hope everything went well, friend. Have to head out for the night, Jess. Thank you for being here too. It's always so good to see you. I hope that you have a really good night. It's like, I know it's like upward. It's not like on the ground. Oh, 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 hello. I think I like heard we were close to a dude. Hey, VG fan, thanks so much for the raid. Welcome, welcome in. Um, is it Chelsea? Hello, Apex Gaming. Hey, how's it going? If you guys are new here, my name is Wade. I am a variety games caster. We're currently playing some Subnautica Below Zero. Um, I also like some cozy games like Stardew Valley, uh, Story of Seasons. We're glad to have you here. VG, how was your stream? What were you playing? Oh, I totally didn't mean to like chuck my flare like that. That wasn't a very good idea. <laughs> Um, Apex Gaming, thanks so much for the follow. If we have a, um, moderator being in here, could we get a shout out for, uh, VG Fan? Phantom, thanks so much, I appreciate it. Tell me all about your stream, VG. How was it? Oh, you were playing some, were you playing some OG Subnautica? How was it? First playthrough, or have you played before? Tell me, tell me all the juicy details. I want to know, I want to know. And Drago, thank you for the refer command too. Also, um, is it, uh, is it Maid? Am I pronouncing your name right? I feel like I butchered it. Thank you for the follow. You guys are so sweet. Thanks for all the love. We're really glad to have you. Um, I don't want to spoil anything for people that have not played Below Zero yet. I will warn you, we are like pretty like far along in the game right now. Um, but we certainly enjoy having you here. We certainly enjoy having you. But just definitely don't want to spoil anybody's experience, that's for sure. Was it this that led back to the the base thing? I just, I don't even know where I am anymore. Oh, 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 he can come down here? Dude, don't do that, not cool. Okay, I have been through here before. Oh, um, OG Subnautica, nice, nice. I hope that uh, your playthrough's been going well. You can go this way or you can go that way. Um. I don't, I don't even know. What have you been up to in uh, Subnautica? What you get, get up to today? Oh. Maybe I should have like continued going that way. All right, we're like, oh, I'm getting stuck, getting stuck. Oh, let's just go around this way. That works. All right, let's, let's see if we can find a way back to those trees. In before it's like not even trees, which wouldn't surprise me because it doesn't say exploitable for the trees. Where'd this go to? Oh, I've been down here before. Um, yeah, yeah. This is like going into the, the ice worm hole. All right, let's go ahead and switch you out to that. 
Uh, also, hey, Susie, thank you for the host. I appreciate it. How are you? I hope you're having a great one. Can we get a shout out for Miss Sucral Yay, too? She's a wonderful bean. Was washing my cup in the sink and was like, ooh, that sounds like a raid. Thank you, Phantom. I appreciate it, buddy. Thanks for all your help. Um. Okay. I was thinking that I like needed to be like higher up. in order to get back to where I, I wanted to go, but maybe it was more this way. <sighs> I assume I can spoil some of uh, OG Subnautica, right? I Yeah, I've, I've played a, a couple times myself. I can't promise that, you know, everybody in here has, but at the same time, like, I feel like most, most folks, like, um, you know, who have are playing um, Below Zero, like, have played the original one. At least I hope so, because the original one's so wonderful. <gasps> Wait a minute, I don't think I've been here before. I haven't. It's like crazy, like, st New blueprint synthesized. I have been here, but somehow I missed the thumper. Okay, all right. <laughs> So that's the elusive thumper that they were talking about that like deters the, the ice boys. Okay, all right. I'm glad that we got that now that like we don't even need it. Thanks, game. <laughs> Dangerous weather approaching. Oh Seek man. Shelter. But yeah, no, I would love to hear about uh, your playthrough. <gasps> Wait a minute, are those the trees? Are those the trees that I need? Oh, this is looking like something, my friends. Um, can I get, how do I, Ooh. Um, there's a cave here, or do I go down there? That looks like a really steep fall. <sighs> I think this is, I think this is, maybe, maybe the place? That water's not frozen there. Um. I'm sensing interesting patterns to the northeast. It would be worth investigating. Oh! But oh. be careful. Of what? I recall ravenous creatures tunneling beneath the ice. We've already been there, Alan! Thanks for the heads up now! <laughs> oh, man. Of course he lets us know about it now. Oh, wait a minute! I didn't realize that we were so close to the bridge! Okay. All right. Um, yeah, I had no idea that you could get to there like that. All right. So I must ask the question once again, how do we get to the trees? But <sighs> hey, Breezy, thank you so much for the raid. Welcome, welcome in, guys. Hey, Metroid Snacks, welcome in. Night Hunter, hello. Random Looney, I feel that. That's a mood. Um, Evil Ashy. Hey, Ashy. It's nice to see you. Welcome in, guys. If you're new here, my name's Wade. I'm a Variety Games caster. Um, right now, we're playing Subnautica Below Zero, which is the sequel to original Subnautica, one of my favorite games. But I also play some cozy games like Stardew Valley and Story of Seasons. We're really glad that you're here. Breezy, how was your stream? What were you playing today? Phantom, thanks for doing the shout out for Breezy. I feel like I've known Breezy for the hottest of minutes. She's just always like such a cheerful bean. Um, she plays some really cozy games over on her streams. I uh, like some Animal Crossing and some Stardews and some Zeldas. Please, please make sure to go send her some love. Um, is it, uh... Is it red? Am I saying your name right? I feel like I'm not. Um, thank you for the follow. And Night Hunter, thanks for the follow too. We're so glad to have you guys here. Uh, again, we're playing some Subnautica Below Zero right now. I certainly don't want to spoil it for anybody. Um, I know uh, some beans like Breezy are like sensitive to like first person type stuff. So I, I definitely don't want to affect anybody there. Um, but we're certainly glad to have you here. Thanks for the love. Phantom, thanks for doing the shout out for Breezy and Draco. Thank you for that refer command too. Yeah, I know anybody that came in through the raid, we're so glad to have you. If you click on the link in the refer commands, uh, it'll bring you right back here to the channel. We'll just actually count you as being a viewer. 
which is really helpful helpful for us streamer beans. Oh, okay. All right, we're back in this area. Gotcha, gotcha. I think I took a wrong turn then. How do I get to the trees? I'm so confused. Hang on, we're gonna look at a map here. How do you get there? Carefully. Thank you so much, Bristol. Appreciate it. I could have never found it any other way. <laughs> oh, you were doing some Stardew. Nice. Uh, single player? Multiplayer? How's the farm going? Have you have you married anybody in this playthrough? Alright. Logs and commissions. Maps. Glacial Basin. It says that the purple trees... We're right where this uh, tower was. Unless it was a different tower. Wait a minute, wait a minute, whoa, 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 whoa. Pause everything on in, in existence. The purple trees are on the other side of the, of the island. Oh my God, I thought they were on this side. Thank goodness that we looked at the map. <laughs> All right, I think I'm gonna go back this way. Let me get out my snow fox. Um, might as well put that... Oh, uh, you okay? You okay, snow fox? All right, cool beans. It's been a while since we raided over here. I appreciate that so much, friend. Thank you. Um, oh, and no worries. No worries, Night Hunter. Yeah, no, like I said, I know a lot of people have been really excited for this game um, as much as I have and definitely don't want to spoil anything, but we've been so glad to have you here. Catch you next stream. Sounds good. Sounds good. And no worries, Apex. You have a good night too. Pause me to solve. But we're pausing stuff not like this. I can't pause this. Oh no. Also blue shirt high. Blue shirt indeed with some white on here. Undissolve. What color shirt are you wearing? <laughs> Undissolve, thanks so much for the 19 months. Jeez Louise. Guys, come get some hype and chat for Undissolved. Welcome back to the sub family, friend. I really hope that you enjoy your brand new um sub badges and your emotes. And the special role in my Discord. How you doing, Undissolved? It's good to see you. Yeah, yeah, I mean, exactly, exactly about the wrong tower. I was thinking that the trees were on this side of the map. Significance beyond this bridge. It was important to Otera, but more important to me. Will it help us build you a body? I believe so. I mean, it's really weird to me that we're only getting these audio logs now. Um... When obviously, like, we've already, uh, already, like, gotten his body and, and all that stuff. So that's a little interesting. Okay, so the fun part is going to be trying to get back to where I found these purple trees. Because if I remember right, I think I really struggled to find them the first time. And my, my worry is that I'm I'm not, this is not what I need. Guys, like I said, I, I, you know, I try to figure stuff out as much as I can for myself, which we have completely up to this point in the game. Um, but I know it's going to be annoying as butts trying to get back to these purple trees. And since we've already been there before, let me just go ahead and ask to those of you that know, Seek fluid and take. is it from the purple trees that I get the pus? Just before, like, I, so I don't, like, waste my time going there. Mm, I love your new stuff badges. Thanks, Breezy. Yeah, I know. It was, um, it was Rosy Poo that, uh, that did the badges. And I was like, I would like something with tea. I would like something with plants. Because I, I love both of those things. And just, like, it, they're so perfect. They're so perfect. Ooh, undissolved blue for you, too. We're twins. We're twins, my friend. Mm. Oh, and Bristol, I'm glad that you got one of those gifted subs too. Thanks to Rochelle. Rochelle, thank you so much for that again. Gonna go on lurk um, and make a snack. I'm a bit hungry. Please get all the stuffs that you need, Breezy. Thanks so much again for the raid. Okay, I don't need to go back to the to the trees. Okay, all right, guys. Thank you. Thank you for answering that. I, because, I I was genuinely going to try to like go all the way back there. Um, so I'm glad I didn't. I'm glad I didn't. Thank you, guys. Thank you, thank you. Okay, so... It's like not... Spawn nearby failed? 
what? That was weird. I was just looking to see like if if these were it, these yellow flowers, but no. So my thought is that it's either um, the root pustules are either um, below the lily pads or like below the twisty bridges. Exploitable. Like it, it definitely could have been something that I didn't scan before, which it kind of looks like it because I don't see anything like that on here. All right, okay. I hope it's not something that I missed on land. Hello? We have gathered the this is Wade. Components to begin constructing we weapon. have. I need Great. pus. What's next? Let's get you out of my head. First, you must find the fabrication facility. The what? It is concealed at some depths. You mean I can't just make a body with my fabricator? So planned on needing to make new bodies? It is a standard medical facility. A medical facility where you just replace your whole body when it wears out? Sounds a little beyond standard to me. Ours was a research mission of the highest importance. Blue so, intake. what were you, a scientist like me? I am a scientist now. So, what happened? Your team found the vaccine and then... Please, Robin, you have the components. Find the facility. Find the facility? Can you tell me, like, okay, where it is? Don't think I don't notice you changing the topic. Um, I, so he tells me I need to find the facility, but doesn't give me any inclination as to where it could be? Really? That sucks. That's not nice. <sighs> So now I'm really confused because the whole thing about like, it, you know, this is like obviously like a late game thing. And you know, it, with typical progression in, you know, not only Subnautica, but games, you know, it just like the late game stuff seems to be like the late game areas. And so, like, based on that logic, I would think that I would find this, what did, what did he even call it? Like, the body assembly station or whatever it was. Like, I think I would find it, like, close to the, where the purple um, crystals were. But, like, we already found that, like, um, that, like, facility down there that had the, the organs. I don't know how I could have like missed a whole other like base facility down there. I really wish that he would just he would just give us just like a little hint as to where it could be. Maybe like after like I build the parts, maybe he would. Or maybe I can't even build them here. Maybe I have to. I was assuming that yeah, I had to put the components together at this facility. But I was thinking maybe I could make them here. Let's go find out, let's go find out. <sighs> He's about as helpful as every other voice in my head. Lux, that is a mood. Oh, feels bad, feels bad. All right, so. Upgrades, deployables, equipment. So yeah, maybe electronics. All right, easy way for us to, to figure it out. Um, let me just get the, the the stuff for it in my inventory. See fluid intake. Oh, okay, we'll just go ahead and drink that. Or attempt to at least. 
didn't realize we were so low on the Vital hydration. I guess technically we do have like a lot of these. I, I could just go ahead and do that. Mm. As opposed to wasting my water like I just did, but there you go. There you go. All right. Um, I really should plant um, some of this. I think it's time that we go ahead and make some more plant pots because yeah, that's that's kind of overdue. All right, so I'm gonna take the habitat builder back. I think it's just titanium that we need for the plant pots. So we'll get that. Hey, Obscurum, thanks for keeping me hydrated. How's it going? I'm guessing it's down deep. That's what I'm thinking. But like, again, like I... Was there like another section of the, the crystal area that I missed? Maybe now that like we have all the parts, maybe like when I go back down there, like Alan will be like, okay, like you're close to it or something like that. I don't know. I don't know. Um, titanium, take that. So let me put one of those in there. No, actually we're gonna do three of those. Doop doop. Um, let's take a couple of these. Uh, those, uh, the red spiral plants out there, they startled me. I was like, is that a, uh, a, um, what is it called? Chalicerate? Shil is that a chalicerate out there? <laughs> okay, so I have all of this stuff in my inventory to make the organs. It looks like I have to take the materials to, um, I guess we just have to take the raw materials to this facility, wherever it is. And I still don't even have the, uh, the pus, the root pus. Okay. Um, Let's go ahead and make the um, the plant pots that I was talking about. Put that there. We'll do, 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 do. Which ones do we have? I think there are only two of the plant pots in this game. Because in the original game, there were three different ones. Unless I missed one somewhere, which I definitely could have. I wish I could put that right there. That's like... That's like perfect. Oh, that's annoying as butts. I guess we could just put it right there, but it's the principle of the thing. All right, so we'll put you right there. We think, how does that look? I guess that's not bad, that's not bad. All right, we'll put you, um, where did I want this to go? Would that be even maybe? Um, I think that's pretty even. I think that's all right. OCD is appeased. Feels good, man. Mm. Fabrication facility. Yeah, that's what it was called. That's what it was called. Thank you. Thank you, Bristol. Okay, so let's, um... I'm trying to think what I want to put in what. Um... We'll put that in there. I'll just go ahead and put both of these in there for... Or do I want to eat that one? Um, yeah, I'm going to eat this one. Okay, um, so maybe I'll go ahead and do another first aid as well. We'll grab another one out. We might as well use them since we have them. Okay, so let's um, put some more materials away. And... I guess we we gotta start looking for the uh for the, the the root pus. Again, I've got a couple ideas of where it could be, but I'm not sure. We'll see, we'll see, my friends. Okay, so um do, 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 do. copper can go in where did I have the copper? We had copper right here. Alright, cool. 
Then um, we can put the uh, fiber mesh over there. All right, I think that's good enough for now. Okie dokes. Um, actually, JK, we're going to put these by Pangling in there too, because I don't think I'll need him right now or ever again. Okay, so um, yeah, let's get our handy dandy sea truck and see about tr trying to find some, some root pus, my friends. <sighs> like, you know, part of me is like relieved that it wasn't the 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 purple trees because I really didn't want to try to go back there. But the other part of me is like kind of like annoyed because like on like the PDA, it just like kind of like really leads you to believe that it could be that because like the color and like the texture looks exactly the same. Um, it even like mentions like the roots in the PDA thing. So we're looking for root pus, my friends. Root pustules. Delicious. I've got to find the way to get deeper, which I think is actually right there. Just like looking everywhere right now. <sighs> Obscurum, I'm glad that you're doing well. I'm doing well here too, thanks. Chalicerate, yeah, yeah. Uh, I have, oh, you pronounce it very differently? Uh, I have no idea the correct way though. I'm curious, like, how do you say it? I don't even know if I'm saying it right. But I'm going with it. <laughs> I can't remember what kind of baddies were down here. I don't think there were any... I don't think there were any um, leviathans down here. Don't quote me on that though. There's like a not so nice boy here. There's something right here. What are you? Let me get my shocker ready just in case. Don't know where he went. Um. Yeah, there's the shark guys down here. Okay. So, um, but I don't think the shark guys are, oh, that's not what I want. Um, let's try that again. I don't think the shark guys are Leviathans. Fabricator module. Ooh, 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 ooh. Okay. Can we actually make the fabricator now? Now that we're like this, like deep into the game. Oh, glorious day. All right, so it kind of like taps out here. There's some more of these like geyser things here. I didn't realize that they were all the way down here too. To be fair, like when I first came to this area, I just kind of <laughs> tried to get out as quickly as possible. Cause it's very scary. We're looking for root pustules, my friends. I'm just like trying to like cut at everything right now. I can't like, cut at the vines themselves, no. It wouldn't be like on that, right? I'm just like trying like everything at the moment. No, okay. Um, boo, 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 boo. Root pustules, where are you? Hmm, oh, getting stuck. Oh, oh, getting really stuck. <laughs> okay, um... I'm really not seeing anything down here that, that could be that. So I think we're gonna move on more towards, like, the lily pad biome. Wait a minute, wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Like, this is like a root. This is a root. This, this, this should be it. <laughs> I got so excited. Got so excited. Oh, all right. Okay. Wasn't there, like, that other, like, creature that, um, we came across and, like, it looked like a root system? Fauna? Carnivores? 
plunger. Eye jelly. Maybe it's the hive mind that I'm thinking of? Grow in massive clusters, physically connected by a root system, which sends out chemical signals in the presence of large predators. The signal activates a chemical reaction with its, its green porous membrane, resulting in a visible change in color in its bioluminescence. This action has two effects. So maybe those uh, green and purple things that I saw earlier were connected to the hive mind? They must have been. Grants the hive mind the appearance of one large interconnected organism. This is a form of camouflage called disruptive coloration, which is confuse confusing to predators. Smaller sea creatures confuse the change in color for sunlight and are drawn toward the clusters. I think I remember seeing those again, like in the in the um, lily pad deeper areas. Like that's that's the only thing that I can think of. Like which would make sense because you know this is like a, a late game thing. This is like a that's a late later game area. Yeah. All right, so we'll go back to Wade Base and we'll repair our poor sea truck and we'll eat some stuffs. And then I think we'll uh, we'll go on a another adventure, my friends. Sound good? Sound good. All right, to the moon pool, which is right here. Huh. Mm, Jeffrey, welcome in. How's it going? Welcome aboard, Captain. It's storming here now. Dang weather, make up your mind. Yeah, it's been like really like overcast and like rainy here too. Um, since we got back, I think it's gonna like continue to for like the next like couple days. I like rain at night because it makes me sleepy during the day. All right, so um. I was just thinking to myself um, whether I wanted to go ahead and bring the other ingredients with me. If I did though, um, I was thinking I would need to make a fabricator module on my, um, on my sea truck. I think we'll be fine without it because like I can go ahead and get I can go ahead and make the what do you what you call it the synthetic fiber or whatever it is where is the thing yeah the synthetic fiber one ruby and one spiral plant clipping okay let's go ahead and get that all right see doop 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 I'll get out this and then I'll take you I might have like had some extras that I put inside, but now we have another, so this is fine. I should have gotten some uh, some of the gel sack. I might have that in here too, now that I think about it. Yes, we do, cool beans. All right, so I'll take you, you. What else do we need? Do I need anything else from here? Then we can come back. Okay, so we'll go ahead and get a ruby, which is right here. Didn't have as much ruby as I was thinking, but hopefully it'll be enough for like the rest of the stuffs. All right, we'll make that. I'm going to need, what else am I going to need? I'm going to need three diamond, which is somewhere in this establishment. One, two, three. Um, Maybe I should go ahead and make that, I was about to say, make that storage module on um, the UC truck. I don't think I have that one yet. <sighs> I should have like paid it better attention to where I was getting like some of the scans. Cause like the other stuff probably would have been around there. I've only got one out of three on there. I wonder where the other ones were. <sighs> um, okay. Let's look on here. 
For the polyaniline, I need one gold, one hydrochloric acid. We already have hydrochloric acid right there, and the gold is right here. Okie dokies. Let's go ahead and make that. Then for the plasteel ingot, I think it's just one lithium. Which I think is over here where the titanium is anyway, so that works out. And then I think we'll have everything that we need except for the uh, for the good old root pus. Oh, okay, making some progress, my friends. It's a root, it just doesn't have pustules. I know, I was lied to. Feels bad, man, just feels bad. I'm pretty sure when you see the thing, uh, you'll know it since you know what they they look like now the the root pustules. Yeah, I hope so But yeah, I, I'm, I'm definitely going to head towards the lily Pad biome. I don't know for sure that it's gonna be there But like I feel like there were like a lot of root systems over there. So that's just like kind of my thinking right now all right, what did I need for... Okay, I need one more lithium. Gotcha. All right, okay. And then we'll have everything. I'm gonna have a pretty full inventory, so hopefully we'll actually have um, room for, like, if we pick up anything. That's about halfway done. We'll go here. We'll turn that into a plasteel. Okie dokes. Cool beans. Uh, let me go ahead and unpin some of these things since I really don't need them. Unpin that. Unpin you. I want to keep that one there so we can see what the pustules look like. Okay, so I'll get some more food and water before we go anywhere. I've got one water on me. I've got a nutrient block. I really wanted to keep that water for our uh, for our trip since it's a plus fifty. I feel like that'll be helpful. All right, let's take some of these Chinese potatoes. Don't really help the best. Maybe I should do some marble melon instead. Yeah, that's probably gonna be better. All right, we'll take you, we'll take you. Getting stuck on my plants over here. <laughs> I really need to do some reorganizing. Um, do that, do this. We will cut that one. Um, dupe, dupe. Dupe. Oh, and I had like one more here. We can take that too. All right, eat that one and then we'll replant this guy. All right. I think we're ready, my friends, for uh, for another adventure. Sound good? All right. I don't know like why I'm just like nervous like right now as if like we're going, I mean like technically we are kind of like going into, um, you know, enemy territory like all over again. But, like, I just think right now I'm, like, nervous with that and the fact that, like, I don't know if this is the right area that I need to go to. But I just, I like to try to figure out for myself as much as possible. We can do it. We can do it. Mm, I can give you a very general tip about, uh storage sea truck scans yeah no go for it go for it serenity like the only thing that i can think of is like if i found one in the area before like the other ones are probably going to be in that same area which is kind of true to like subnautica and like the scans for like everything i've just been silly and not like paying attention to that kind of stuff <laughs> when i should have okay so i'm gonna close out that one we're gonna go towards this because that's gonna take us back to lily pad One pretty easy way to figure out where stuff is in, in the game is to look up on the wiki. I know, I know, and I definitely don't want to do that. When, uh, like, after I, like, completed my first, uh, Subnautica playthrough of the original one, I really devoured that wiki, though, because I just think it's, like, so interesting. Like, you find out about, like, more stuff that you didn't know, like, when you were playing. Um, so I can definitely see myself doing that, like, after completing this, uh, this playthrough here. <laughs> just making a joke. I got you. I got you. <laughs> you never bring a beacon. I don't. I don't. I really should. But I just, you know, just like to find things, you know, just 
uh, the hard way. That's me. That's me. <laughs> Excuse me, boys. Coming through. Don't mind me. We are looking for root pus. These don't look like roots to me. Let me go ahead and get my shocker out. Just in case. Just in case. Okay. So... The uh, Lily Dumahickeys are going to be higher up here. There are some roots. Wait a minute. Hang on. Hold up. No, I thought it was like underneath it for a second. I don't think that's it. Is it? Those are like purple. I'm just going to get out just to like test it. Uh, no. Okay. Just wanted to try it. Just wanted to try it. Back in we go. Alright. Root push tools. Following the roots. And, like, I don't think I can, like, cutting at these will do anything. Like, I feel like the push tools, like, I would, it would be something that I would see, like, on the, the outside of it. It wouldn't just, like, grant it to me from, like, cutting at it. This is where I went in before, right? There wasn't anything in here, right? Creature egg. I don't know if I have that one. There's, a, like, a lot of roots in here, but I don't know if it's the roots that I need. I don't think so. Um... Alright. Where even is my sea truck? Over here. Yeah, I'm gonna try to go, like, deeper down and see if we can find anything that way. Mm. I never used a single beacon in OG Subnautica, but I used so many in this game. Like, the only time I've ever really used them is, uh, is, like, for a base. Where is that? Okay. Well, okay. So, this is going to be going down to... Margaret's base. So it could be like some some uh roots down here. These are some big and pretty big roots. Um or it could be more towards the like anemone side. I like couldn't like cut at this, right? No. Can't cut it, you guys. No. Okay. What about you? No. Okay. Just trying everything right now. Are these like the Reaper, um, the Reaper wine glass things? They kind of look like them. I don't know what those are, but they're pretty. Um, hmm. All right, let's keep exploring. We've got to find it. And if it's like nowhere underneath this lily pad biome, I'm just going to be all kinds of confuzzled. Hmm. I think this might be going the wrong way again. Yeah, it is. It is. All right, back we go. I feel like this game isn't at all uh, hard to find stuff. I usually only look at the wiki for games where I have to uh, give people stuff like Story of Z. Yeah, yeah, same here, same here. Um, there have been like some things in this game, like with these, uh, the root pus that I've had trouble with. And like some some other things that are like purposely like difficult to find, but it hasn't been ridiculous. Okay, 
Okay. All right. This looks... No. Okay. Looked like something. But I don't think it was. Uh, nothing over there. I guess we'll keep going downward. Root pus, root pus, root pus, root pus. What a beautiful song. <laughs> Never thought I'd be singing about pus. Oh, I did take a wrong turn. This is the uh, this is the anemone one. Well, I wanted to look down here too. So let's just take a gander, see if we come across any root pustules. Those are some pretty chonky roots. Like, I don't think you can harvest anything from, like, these leaves. No, that's not roots anyway. Um... Hmm... Okay... No. Just thought I would try it. Cause like it looked like like a root system. But I guess it's not the root system. Big sad, big sad. Mm, space Pro, welcome in. How's it going? Mariana's trench is uh eleven thousand meters deep. That's like it just it's crazy, like how like big like our world is and I, I fully believe that there's like stuff that we haven't even like discovered yet you can get stuff out of order in this yeah no 100% you know it's the beauty of um of uh, open world games like this you can kind of play in your own order all right this went down to one of those this went down to, um, like, that garden with, like, the, the alien facility. I don't think there was anything for, like, the root pustules down here, but I'm just gonna make sure. Um... Was this a dead end? I thought this was the right way. Did I go into a crevice that I shouldn't have? Oh, <laughs> that thing just like blew up right in front of me. Sorry. Sorry, spore boy. I was thinking it was down there. Did I, where did I take a wrong turn? Um, wasn't it down there? I feel like I'm going crazy here. Hmm. Why would this just lead into nothing? Like, I feel like this was around the entrance of, um, that garden doomahickey, wasn't it? Maybe it wasn't. <sighs> um... Okay. Also, I, I know that like some of you guys in chat have been playing this game as well and you're probably like beating your heads right now just like, oh, just like want to like tell me and, and that kind of thing where it is because I'm like really struggling but I appreciate you guys um, watching me struggle because yeah, I just I want to try to find it to the best of my ability. I want to find that cave where Marguerite's base is again and take a look there. Otherwise, where can I find a root system? Hmm. 
Maybe it was this way? Maybe this was it? I don't know. I am all sorts of confuzzled. Um... Nothing like back there, right? Well, excuse me. Excuse me, big anemones. Pardon me. Um... Hmm... I get disoriented in this game really easily. It's like really like a maze in some areas because, you know, it, it'll have like all of this stuff around that like looks exactly the same. So yeah, in those instances, like the, the beacons or like the pathfinder and that kind of stuff could be really helpful. Um, is it, is it, uh, D Demoldson? Did I say your name right? Thanks for the follow. How's it going? I hope you're having a great day. Hmm. Um. Well. I guess we'll just go back up. See, I feel like I've explored this a, a decent amount. I'm gonna I'm gonna look at where her base is and see if we can find any stuff around there. Mm, have you scanned all the fishies down here? Um, I I think I scanned most of them, but maybe I haven't. If we come back there, I I'm, I might have to check because I know I got out and like one area recently and um, did some more scanning of the fishies. I can't remember if it was here or not. Alright, so now to try to find her base again. I always struggle to find her base and end up at the anemones. Okay, she's like way over here. Alright, cool beans. It is painful just a little. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm doing my best. But if, um, I mean, if I don't end up finding it in here, like the only other cave I can think of is like the one under the, the purple vents. So we could check there. And if it's not there, then I really think that I just, I, I've missed it in a place that I already was at. Um... Is, yeah. I think this is right. Maybe, maybe not. No, this is the way that I always like accidentally go to. I should just like bring like a beacon like to get back to her base because I always, always struggle with it. I think I've been in here. It might just lead out to the other side. Um. Oh, hello. How's it going? Nothing to see here. Ah. <sighs> get a sip of my tea. Do I have any tea left? Just a little bit of tea. Nailed it. Nice. Nice. And it's going well. Going well. I'm currently trying to find an item in the game. Doing my best to try to find it myself, but struggling a little bit. Struggling a little bit. But otherwise doing okay. We made a lot of progress in the game today. I honestly was not expecting us to like make this much progress. I was thinking that maybe we could find like one other like part of his body like the the blueprint for it but we found both of them like all three so that was pretty juicy um okay let's go back over here and then we'll kind of like go downward from there i love the plants in this place hey shaman how's it going yeah i know just like subnautica plants make me so happy just plants in general make me so happy Let's go a little more this way. 
Just looking at like any route that I see. Mm, was it through there? I can never tell. I can never tell. Um, go through here. And was it down here, maybe? Possibly. I was thinking that maybe since like the the root had like broken open, maybe we were onto something there. Especially since it was kind of like the right color. But it doesn't seem like it. I think that's going back the way that I'm not supposed to go. Um, why am I struggling so bad to find her face again? I'm so sorry, friends. Um, yeah, about the, the hive mind. Um... Hmm. I'm looking for like the lights. But I'm not seeing them. I'm not seeing them. Um Within 20,000 meters, thank you so much. Thank you so much. I would I would have never found it Bristol without you. Hi shark. How's it going? Let me go like back like straight over here and we'll look for the stuff. All right, signal starts right here. So was it like in here? Is that where it was? Oh my God, was it here like the entire time? <laughs> was it that easy? It was, oh my God. Oh, it was, it was literally right there. I was just like, just completely skipping over that cave entrance. And I've like, I've tried to cut at those before. That didn't work. Meaty, thank you for the reminder to save too. Root pushed wolves. Hmm. Um. More hive mind stuff there. Getting bonked around. Um. All right. Here's her base. I'm just, I'm not seeing anything that, that could be good postules. The only thing that, like I said, I can think to do is go into like the caves where the, where the, like the underneath the purple vents, see if we can find me there. If I don't, if I don't find me there, 
at that point, I I, I, I may take a, a, a hint from you guys. Um, not right now, but if I don't end up finding anything there, I might, because at that point, I think I'm kind of like out of ideas. Now to figure out how to get back out of here. <laughs> After we worked so hard to get back down here is the question. <sighs> Um, that base looks really cool. It does, it does. Yeah, no, just like the whole story like behind her is like r really amazing. Like, you know, Marguerite, she's like really sassy um, in the, in the first game and in this game. But like, especially after like learning that like she survived after all of that, it's just, you can't help but like respect her. Is she? That's a really big egg. Holy moly. <laughs> I was not expecting it to be that big. I think that's the biggest egg I've ever, like, had. Jeez. Let's go ahead and drink that water. Vital signs stabilizing. Um, I know she was at the greenhouse earlier. So does she, like, teleport back and forth depending on where you are? Or would she still be at the greenhouse? I'm curious. Because I know the last time that we were here, um, her snow stalker was guarding the way. Oh, she is back here. Hello again. Hmm. Hello. How's it going? I don't think we can talk to her, though. Can we get past the door? I think we can get past the door this time. He's pretty chill. What can we steal? Oh, this is like... Why is there just like this empty room here? Abandoned PDA. I'm really glad that we came back in here, guys. Nice. Oh, this is like her bed here. This is where she does the sleepings and stuffs. Okay. All right. Look, it's the, oh, it's the gorge toy. I missed the gorge toy from the first game. Oh, the gorge toy was my favorite. I don't think I can take anything else here. All right. Um, Let's go ahead and listen to that log that we got. Fortnite into our voyage. What about Fortnite? I was more or less living inside the creature's rib cage. Ooh. It meant shelter, and it meant food. The flesh was starting to rot. The stench was unlike anything I'd ever smelled. Ooh, ooh, wait, hang on. What was that? As we floated, the temperature dropped, and the rotten. A small stove. What? Slowly, almost imperceptibly, ooh. the Reaper began to lose buoyancy. We sank a little each day. My sanctuary was becoming my tomb, and I was at the mercy of the current and the wind. <gasps> Until one day, uh, oh, I saw a what? smattering of penguins oh. in the distance. Well, that, I was Some not expecting that. Usually means solid a land shower? of some kind. I was lucky. The winds followed their path. It's Hours bobo later, trees. I, I want the bobo trees. Side. They're my favorite. Upon the water. I don't think I can take them now. Big sad. It renewed my spirit as I watched the land get closer and closer. A toilet? Okay. You just make a bathroom now? No longer worried. When the reaper finally sank below the water, I was and the lantern trees. Oh, I love them so wish. much. Skull. Big sad, big sad. I didn't ride the beast for three weeks. And a sink. To have no Gotta food. have a sink in a bathroom. Gotta wash our hands. Never felt so we're not so filthy. Good. Filthy, Even dirty animals. Arctic hell. Okay, alright. So, um, we can make a bathroom now. Cool. We got her other log. And I'm glad that we came back here. It was, uh, quite juicy. Quite juicy. Um... I'm not seeing anything else though. I think we've gotten everything back here. Okie dokes. All right. Thanks for your services, Marguerite. Much appreciated. Much appreciated. All right. What is she looking at at the PDA? Let's look over her shoulder. <laughs> um, I think we got everything off here. Yeah. Okay. All right. So to the purple vents, I suppose. Yeah, yeah. See if I can find anything there. Where is my truck? Do 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 do. There we go. 
It upsets me that the Volvo trees are just for decoration. Yeah, no, like any of the the land stuff um, from the original game, it, it seems like you can't really collect in this game. Like um, when we were in that garden where we found one of like Alan's body parts, there were like voxel shrubs down there, some other stuff. Um, and yeah, no, we couldn't take any of it, like the mushrooms. Um, you can take the lantern trees? You just, uh, wait, hang on, hold up. Could I actually? I'm going back. I'm going back. I'm glad that you said something. I would have totally missed it. I love the lantern trees. I don't know why I, like, didn't think to, uh, to, like, just try and grab the fruits. But it wouldn't let me scan it, right? I guess that's maybe why I assume not. I'm not, I'm actually not seeing any fruit on here that you can grab. Am I going crazy? Yeah, no, I, yeah, I don't think so. That would have been nice though. That would have been nice. I'm glad we at least checked. Oh well. Mm. <laughs> Was she <laughs> looking? I don't know, I don't know. Things get a little lonely down here, meaty. I wouldn't blame her. I wouldn't blame her. She, she gets some, uh, some good Wi-Fi down here at the base. <laughs> All right, so back in here. <sighs> These are the, the Reaper wine glasses that we found before. It's just weird to me that they say like exploitable, like you can take something from them. When that doesn't seem to be the case. I, I don't know why that is. Hmm, okay. Yep, yep, yep. Well, uh, we shall return from whence we came. I don't think there was anything else down here, no. All right. Uh, so, let's go upward. Hmm. Um, do 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 trying to find my way back out. I guess we can just follow the uh, the hive mind here. <laughs> the way that I like found this place. That would that would probably be a, a good way to to get out. Good idea. Good Duncan. Hmm. Um Let's proceed this way. And we'll go up here, but yeah, no, like, I haven't even, like, found, like, I mean, it could be at, like, a, a place that I haven't been to yet, because I haven't been to... I have not been to the Outpost Zero. Haven't been there. And I haven't been to the Omega um, lab either. Haven't figured out how to get to either of those. Granted, it's been a really long time since I tried to get to the uh, to the Outpost Zero. But I don't know if either of those would be the places that would have the the stuff. I feel like if either of those places did have it, it would be the out the uh, Omega one. But yeah. Okay, so let's go to, um, I think that direction. I think this is going to be the way towards the, uh, the, the purple, whatchamacallit, the purple vents. Just have to watch out for the chalicerate. Hmm. Oh, no worries. No worries, Bristol. Yeah, no, I'm glad that we checked. It, we were right there. So yeah, no, it wasn't any trouble whatsoever. Thank you, though. Much appreciated. Much appreciated. Now to try to find our way back into uh, into these little little caverns here. That might be a, a little difficult. Hmm. Um. Hello. Nothing to see here. Do 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 do. Oh, there's like something right here. Just watching out for Shalicerate, because I know, like, there's one around here. 
deep breaths, deep breaths. What we got here? Docking module, I think I already got that one. Well, now we've completed it, okay, all right. What's the, uh, what's the deal with the docking module one? I wish I brought some more water. Um... Maybe I really shouldn't be looking at this right here. We good? We good? Um, docking module. Rear only sea truck docking module allows you to take your, oh, allows you to take the prawn suit with you? Oh, okay. That makes sense because yeah, I know like up to like this point in the game, I've been kind of like missing the Cyclops because I was like, you know, it was big and it was chonky, but at least you could take the prawn suit with you. So you actually can take it with you here as long as you find the module first. That's the thing. Oh, guys, I'm I'm not finding anything that looks like a like a root system down here. No, I'm not seeing anything that looks like root pustules. <sighs> Um, yeah, that's, that's going into the crystal caves there. Okay. All right, guys, I think I've gotten to the point. I, like, I will say, like, don't tell me, like, exactly where to find it, but if anyone has, like, a general hint of maybe, like, the direction or what it could be around... I think I would be down for that at this point. Uh, gimmickry, thank you for keeping me hydrated. Same thought. <laughs> and thank you for the posture check as well. Oh, just a little chair stretch here. Hi, Pandoodle. How's it going, Bean? It's good to see you. I hope that you're having a great day. Oh, don't blame me. Just getting resituated here. Oh, God. Uh, feels good. You saw it early in game? Okay. Early in game. Well, early in game, I mean like the earliest of the game would have been around my, um, Um, drop pod, so I might look there. Okay, all right. Thank you guys, I appreciate the, the vague hints. Thank you, thank you, friends. I'm just like over here looking in like the deeper areas. But yeah, no, I just, I must have just like clearly like overlooked something like right in front of my face. This way we go. Oh, no, no, JK, JK. Not that way. Not that way. Did I get him? Did I get him? I don't think I got him. I didn't get him. I didn't get him. There we go. Okay, I got him that time. Oh. Oh. Oh, I always use it, like, too early. Oh. Oh, it's going well, uh, finishing up an art piece, uh, that has a, a background. Ooh, Pandoodle. I, um, I would imagine, like, it, it takes, like, a lot more time when you're doing a background and everything. Don't normally do a background. I hear that from, like, a lot of artists, and, like, you know, it's completely understandable because, you know, you're not just doing, like, you know, the main focus of it, but, like, all that, like, extra stuff, and, um, I feel like for beings that aren't artists like myself. I feel like we can't have a, like a full appreciation of like what you guys do. I would love to see it though, Pandoodle, if it's like something that you can't even share um, when you're done. I'm sure it's beautiful. Where am I even going? I'm going in the wrong direction. Don't mind me. And believe it or not, like that uh, that thing that just attacked us, that was like not even the uh, the the scariest thing that we've we've come across in this game. Yeah, no, it's been uh, it's been lovely. It's been lovely today. 
Mm, you know when the ice falls when it storms in this game? Uh, uh, that's what the hail is doing right now at my house. Jeez Louise, Gwen. You stay indoors and you uh, just stay safe, please. Pretty please with the cherry on top. Hope no uh, damage to the house or anything like that. Or the cars. That'd be not so pretty. Okay. Um, let's take a look around. Let's see what we can find. I feel like it's been a hot minute since I've been back to this area. Where our initial pod was. Root pustules. I'm looking for roots. Hmm. Speaking of which, I need to recolor my hair. Um, like, we got these dudes. I don't know if this was supposed to fit down here, See but... Fluid intake. Can I get this back out? <laughs> Very carefully. I know, I need all the things. Come on, come on, just, just squeeze through. <laughs> Guys, how did I get it through here? Oh, okay, all right. Note to self, don't do that again. Um, okay, all right, so. Like, I mean, like, the first place that they started out in the game was, like, on that island, but... Like, the Arctic island, that closed-off area, I would be really surprised if it was there. Maybe I should like go back to where that like that cache was. Emergency supply cache. Let me go in that direction and see what we can find. Um, you guys are great at this vague hinting. Kudos to y'all. Yeah, no, you guys are doing great. Thank you so much for the for the vague help. I can share, share how it looks currently, just working on uh, cleaning up and shading. Oh, I would love to see. I would love to see, Pandoodle. Just let me know where you're posting, whether that be on, like, Twitter or Discord or whatever. Hmm. I just had a thought. Like, weren't there, like, the, um... Like, some things hanging, like, down from some of the icebergs. I don't know if that would be, like, related at all, but, um... I might look back into that, too. Um... Ooh, there was like something under here. I'll take that nutrient block, sure. Um, this is what I was talking about. Frost anemone heart, that's not what I was looking for. Um, trying to get away from that dude. I don't know where he went now. immediately. I like, I can't like cut at it, right? Mm, no, that's the thought that I had. Okay, all right, so it's not that. I really wish we could find some water around here. That'd be really lovely. <laughs> we gotta go make some. Sea truck is this way. Hmm. I just, I feel like it's like right in front of my face and I'm, I'm missing it. Hey, Ben Joseph, nice to see you. How are you? I'm doing well, doing well, thanks. It's been good to get back into stream streaming since, uh, since vacation. How have you been? I hope you're doing well. 
Apparently the file is uh is too big without nitro. Oh no, oh no. Heckin' heckin' nitro, heckin' discord. I don't know if it would like let you upload like a like a smaller resolution or something like that. If it's too much trouble though, don't worry about it. I just love your arts and stuff, so it's just so beautiful. Um Emergency. Starvation imminent. Seek gallery and take immediately. I won't be going out there, but it's uh it's not supposed to last too long. That's good, that's good. Hopefully, in, in case you do need to go out there. That, that would suck. Bring an umbrella and like it just like hails all through the umbrella. Big sad. Mm. Those are the best food in the game. Yeah, no, I like, I remember like grabbing one at, at some point. I guess I could go ahead and do that. I should have like grabbed like all of those. That would have been like helpful for my hydration. Maybe we can like go back. <laughs> um. Hmm. I think there are some more like in this direction underneath like some other icebergs. Let me just go do some investigations and stuffs. I think there were at least. Maybe it was like more in that direction. No, that's kind of like going underneath the iceberg. Um. Excuse me, Mr. Fishy Boys. I'm sorry, don't mean to hurt you or anything. I don't know if I can go under underneath there. Oh, there's some of this stuff over here. Alrighty. Seek fluid intake. Is that like bleeding back into somewhere? It kind of like looks like it is. Vital signs stabilizing. Yeah, I should have just like grabbed all of those that I saw back there. I like didn't even like think about it. Can I get my truck back here? Oh, it's a bit of a tight squeeze. Oh, hello, hello, Heist. How you doing? And before there's nothing back here. Um. Oh, 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 oh! Hello. How's it going? Don't eat me, please. I would like to get those, um, those, those, those fruit doomahickeys. Let's try to do that. Boop. 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 Alright. We'll go in here. We'll eat this and this and that too. Cool being so like that, like completely healed our hydration. I really probably should not be bringing my, oh, the like ice is like reforming there. Yeah, I probably should not have brought my truck back here. I'm just being a silly billy. Is this just leading back out? I think so. My poor truck, it really needs healing right now. She's having a hard time. There's a lot of these underneath here. Like, this isn't... No. Okay, all right. Just thought I would try. Just thought I would try. Here's the jellies. Okay. Um, let's go ahead and repair you two. Hmm. All right, back in we go. Um, I feel like I'm getting like too far away from the starter area at this point. Just kind of looking to see if there was anything I missed too. Because I think it's in this area where the, whatchamacallit, the um, outpost zero would be. I obviously like don't know how to like get there. Hmm. Um. Hmm. Let's try to decide where I want to go from here. Where did this go to? 
Does it just like end here? Does it just cut off? No, it goes down here. Like, I think I've like followed this all the way before. Maybe it was like intending on like going the other way. Yeah, because that just like cuts off there. Alrighty. Um, so let's go back in this direction, I guess. I just, I'm so sorry, guys. I feel like I'm just like missing something obvious here. I'll do better. Hopefully. Root pustules. I need two. I need two root pustules. Okay. Um, don't see any root pustules in the kelp forest. If that's what it's even called in this game. Hmm. Um. Do 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 do. I think. I'm gonna turn down my uh my light because it's getting a, a little too bright in here. It's like blinding me. It might be a little better. Yeah, it's it might be a little too dark now. Hang on, hold up. We'll try about right there. Oh, I think I found a thing. I mean, like I don't know for sure, but like that looks like that looks like things. That like I can I can take. I'm assuming. I'm assuming so. What do you guys think? Does that look like a thing to you? Hang on, hair is going crazy. I shouldn't have like touched it. Cool. Might have to flip it again. Oh. Can I take you? Root plush jewels. <laughs> Hello. Oh, you beautiful creatures. Oh wow. Okay. Um. I don't know if I'm going to need any more after this, but I'm just going to take as many as I can get because I... Oh, that was that was quite the adventure getting here. Oh, all right. Okay. I mean, like, it was, like, easy getting here, but, like, trying to figure out, like, how to get here. That was not so fun. Thank you, friends. Appreciate you. Okay. Back to, um, business... <laughs> There is so much down here. Um, let's try to get back to our sea truck somehow, some way. I, I don't know which way I came from, but we're just going this way and we'll get back to our sea truck one way or another. One way or another, I'm gonna find ya. I'm gonna get you, get you, get you, get your sea truck. I'm gonna go in ya. I'm gonna drive ya. I'm gonna drive ya, drive ya, drive ya, drive ya. Oh, hello. Um, have I been down here? Another site found, but I cannot yet tell whether the others survived. 
There was just this artifact sitting down here that I had never gotten before? What? Array module? Okay, all right, cool. I'll take you, I suppose. Where, where even are things? I don't know. Um, okay. All right. Cool. So, alien data, array module, cosmetic, communications, array storage, holographic display, alien construction is unknown, no clear indicator of its functions. Interesting. Okay. All right. Yeah. I just had like a thing down here that I just had never scanned apparently. Makes me question like what other things um, have I not? I think this will, yeah, no, we've already gotten that. Okay, all right. Oh, excuse me, pardon me. Leave me alone, sir. Huh. Okay, well, that kind of served like a dual purpose. We got the the pustules and we like found like a new um, artifact. I haven't really understood the, the purpose of the artifacts in this game, if I'm gonna be honest. Like you'll go to them and scan them, but like, I don't know if I'm missing it, but I feel like I don't really get anything out of it. Like, um, like, yeah, unless I'm missing it, it doesn't seem like you get a, um, a, what you would call it, like a, um, blueprint from it or like some substantial data that's really gonna help your quest. I feel like I needed salt for something, but I don't know what it was. What was it for? I don't know, I don't know. All right, so we're back out, but the question is, where is my sea truck? My sea truck is, um, where are you, where are you sea truck? Sea truck is over this way. Can we get there before we drown? Find out next time on Dragon Warning. Ball Z. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. I mean, we can't go up to surface. I guess we'll do that way. This is fine. Ah, oh, thank you guys. Thanks for thanks for your help and believing in me. Much appreciated. Much appreciated. But yeah, no, I just like I I like didn't like realize that it was going to be like something like so like early game, early area type deal. That was uh, quite interesting if I do say so myself. Quite indubitably. All right, so from here we'll go back to our base because I want to. Hold that thought. Would be useful, but ultimately, I have no definitive evidence as to the fate of my people. The network I hoped to rejoin may no longer exist. I cannot feed it. There could be a million reasons for that. Like, what if the network had a system update? They're on version 2001.4, and you're still on version 14.2. That would make me incompatible. How would I even begin to plan my upgrades? Okay. That's not what I meant. Bad example. You still know how to get home? Yes. So don't give up. Go there, see for yourself what happened. You tell him, Robin. Optimism, but it is not supported by probability. Hope isn't based on statistics. It's born from a drive for something better. There's a poem, Eat. Sam. Hope is human. Hope is... Uh, oh, oh, right. Hope is the the thing with feathers that was so this beautiful any fauna designation i can find in your pda it's a line from a 19th century earth author emily something poor emily Hope is she, the thing with she doesn't even get a last name can this fit in here soul. no it can't um without the words and never stop i was about to take that over but it won't fit Promise. okay we'll um one way or another Alan. adding hope to your database Thanks, Alan. Appreciate you. All right, so we'll take those two and we'll go back over here. Let me take some of this diamond out and we'll put that creature egg in. I really need to make an alien containment facility so I can like put some of these eggs in here. That one is huge. I'm trying to think what that could be. I hope it's not like the, uh, the big baddie Leviathan. Research hope, he actually did give us hope. Okay, all right. Hope is an animal of unknown origin, according to Robin, and poet named, oh, it was Emily Dickinson. It's described as having feathers. My database found the poem Robin was referring to. Uh, 
The presence of hope seems to inspire humans to preserve in the face of adversity. Perhaps humans keep a hope with them at all times. I love this. This is so innocent and pure. From this notation, hope appears to be a hardy avian creature. It is capable of surviving at sea and in cold climates, having kept so many warm Hope might be observed to produce exothermic chemical reactions. Assessment, find and maintain hope. We must find it. Where, where is it? Find the hope. <laughs> oh, that's so precious. All right. Um, didn't one of the things I needed, it needed some diamond. Yeah, it did. It needed three. Okay, so I'm not going to put it all away, but we'll put some of it in here. Well, that's not gonna fit all of it. Okay, um, let's take that nickel. I'll put that away. Nickel can go here. All right, so I think I have all of the things to make the parts. Now we just need to find the facility for my friends. 